no, no, no. There's a difference between big violins and cellos. There's there's a difference. There there's oversized violins and then there's cellos. <laughs> The song is so good. You guys were right that it was very hard to find though because of the name. <laughs> How we doing? How we doing today? It's a nice Friday night, okay? Oh yeah, the the beard is gone. Yeah, jump scare, sorry. Nice, nice little, nice little jump scare. <laughs> um, dude, I'm so excited for uh, one to like actually be catching up. It's crazy. We're we're we are properly catching up now. <laughs> I want to do the new like little intro to uh, to part two so badly, so badly. But we have to do all this first. I say all this. It's gonna be fine. It's going to be fine. Today, I'm expecting it to be around seven hours or so. And then, uh, this is not Honkai. That is not Honkai. Why would it just immediately start playing copyrighted music? <sighs> YouTube music. You let me down at the worst times. Okay, there we go. Um, anyway, anyway, I'm expecting today to be about seven hours or so. Um, and then tomorrow is going to be even longer and then sunday is gonna be even longer <laughs> isn't that super fun <laughs> dude sunday is gonna be uh it's gonna be so long it's gonna be as long as uh what was it chapter 30 whatever the most recent one was 39 it's gonna be like 10 hours long something absolutely ridiculous absolutely ridiculous just wait to hear the soundtrack for this arc i'm actually very excited because this this right here, listen to this, dude. When I see myself with a camera without my beard, it looks so weird. The mirror, it's fine, but in the camera, it's not. This right here, look at this. Look at this. I've seen the soundtrack. Oh, you're not even looking at my desktop, bro. Come on now. I've been, I've been being teased by the the image just being here. Like, the entire soundtrack for the arc is right there, and I want to listen so badly. So, so badly. <laughs> uh, after this weekend, I can. I've already, as you can tell, we're listening to this one now. Uh, because I couldn't listen to this one until we finished the last arc. But, here we are. Here we are. I'm glad you haven't. Yeah, no, I try and... The music is such an integral part to the chapter and the storytelling, so I don't go... When I try to stay out of spoiler zones, that includes the music. <laughs> because otherwise, I'm just going to be spoiling myself on like... Because if I listen to like the boss music before we get to the boss, I'm not going to have as cool of a reaction. Because I... That's the thing, chat. I don't... I don't exaggerate my reactions for shit. So when we actually like get to something hype and I'm like, oh my God, this is so cool. <laughs> That's just me legitimately being like, oh my God, this is so cool. <laughs> That's why you don't see me jumping out of my chair. You'll never see me like literally out of my chair like, oh my God. Because that's the, that's the, that's the over-exaggerated shit. <laughs> That's the over-exaggerated stuff. <laughs> welcome in, everyone. Welcome in. <laughs> Yatta! <laughs> oh, and also, once we finish this arc, not only can we actually do... Oh, where did my little music tab go? Um, now, not only can we do uh, the the actual like part two like intro chapter thing, but we can actually look into the, the lore for part two. 
Um, because I have been not looking into anything lore related for part two until we actually are there, technically. Even though I don't think it would spoil, and there's not... Uh, actually, I don't know. I was going to say, I don't think there's much information that I would need to know from where we are now for part two, but I don't know. I can't really say that for certain. Um, but since we will be here for seven and a half hours, we might as well not stall, right? That's one of the best things that we do here is not stall. So let's do that. Um, I will say I did accidentally click into the chapter like right before stream started. And it did this little like intro of this, this hourglass thing, uh, like turning very eerie. Because now I'm thinking, uh-oh, Fuwa has a time limit for something. What that might be, I have no idea. Also, furthermore, I say as I continue to stall, I love playing the Fuhua battle suits because they're the most like a fighting game to me. So when I heard that this is actually how it is, like you have to play all the different, uh, all the different battle suits, this is sick. Okay. This is very cool. I did hear they dumbed it down, though. Is this is that true? Did they actually dumb the, like... And that's not a bad thing, okay? Because the battle suits were a little complicated, I guess, for, like, the normal player base. <laughs> but did they actually, like, change it? Okay, let me word that question better. Let me word that question better. Can I still play the battle suit the way I know to play it? Or am I going to end up not knowing how to play the battle suit because they changed it to make it easier? Was that a better way to word my question? <laughs> I don't know. I definitely used more words there. and That may have sounded a little bit more complicated. <clears throat> you didn't know how to use Night Squire when you tried this? Hey, Night Squire's animations are sick. You're a normie? It's okay. It is okay. <laughs> Fuhua is so complicated. She is. She has a whole she has a whole second button. It's different is all I'll say since you asked. Okay. That's fine. Since since you, you were somewhat vague, I'm going to assume it might be spoilery. Spoilery-ish. Um, this map looks really sick, by the way. Um, okay, let's start, because there is a Okay, I don't know what this is. I didn't mean to click on this. You want Fuhua style kit in Genshin? Hey, it doesn't, uh... Wait, is it? Th Wait, who is it in Genshin that actually uses their hands? Because there is someone that just throws fists. And I just forgot who it was. Welcome in. Welcome in, John. <laughs> this is made for Fuhua fans? That's me! Oh my god, that's me! Oh wait, speaking of which... Where's my controller? I need a controller for this. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, now I'm not stalling. Now I'm just technical issue. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, controller obtained. If I plug this in and it switches my audio source, we're going to do what's called cry. Nope, okay, we're good. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Hi, 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 Zoo, hi, hi, Zou, and Worcester Sire Sauce. Love that man. So attractive. Incredible. Didn't pull for him. Is he out? I guess he is out. Who is most? Isn't Gaming the most recent character? Vanity used cry. <laughs> you're very bad at honk eyes. What I learned. No, no, no. You're not bad. You're not bad, you just need to practice. There's a difference between being innately bad. Um, oh yeah, 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 and the bird. The bird, okay, uh, what am I clicking on? What am I doing, what am I, what am I doing? What am I clicking? There was a way to do action log, yes, prologue. Incredible, what is prologue? Oh, that's loud. Oh, that's so loud. Weaving dreams of divinity. Do this little animation. So Let me know how the audio level goes. It might be too loud, might be too loud enough. Let me know. Ooh, I, like I like the vibe of Birds. Birds. 
You like when Mahoyo uses the silhouette art style like this? I, I, I just love how they actually use a bunch of different styles. Did you forget about the community stream? I didn't forget about it, no. I just haven't had the time to do it yet. <laughs> Dude, look at that star. So, we talked about this last time. I will say. Uh, about even with you audio-wise, you might be a bit quieter. Okay, let me turn that a little bit down. We turn that down just a tad bit. Um, the one downside to being behind is I know, like I know who this is, <laughs> right? I know it's the little lady, little lad. So that reveal isn't going to be as, as epic. But it is what it is. The gods painted the very first image of the world, and thus the hourglass of birth and growth. Oh, I need to read faster. Um, thousands of years flew past in the blink of an eye. An ordinary day in the unchanging time. Oh, good. Oh, good. I just happened to play a time-based arc while we're in Pinnacony, which is also time-based. Look at these pretty-ass trees, dog. What is going on? Is it auto-playing? Why is it? Tiny little Vita. <laughs> Tiny baby Vita. I was trying to read chat, but it just wasn't giving me a chance. It just kept going. Yeah, you tipped at the eons and Black Swan came to me and gave me an earful. Then Clara showed up, all within 20 pulls. Rip my pity for Akron. Hey, it's okay. Akron will also come home early. Akron will also come home early. Dude, enjoy Black Swan. I've, I've actually built her out. Finally, for the first time, I actually built a character. Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. Actually, you guys will be so proud of me. The last couple days, I've been building so many characters in Star Rail. Okay? Jwei-E. Oh my god, she does so much damage now. She does so much damage. I'm also building out my Clara right now as well. Um, I, Actually, I was building out my follow-up team. So, that's what that is. That, that's, that's why I was doing those characters specifically. <clears throat> That's a guarantee for Acheron, though. That is true. That is true. Mark brings up a valid point. You do have Acheron guaranteed now. As long as you don't pull on Sparkle. Just don't pull on Sparkle. Unless you want Sparkle. And then you have a Sparkle guarantee. <laughs> <clears throat> is Honkai Impact new version now on PS5? I don't think Part 2 is on consoles, unfortunately. Um, correct me if I'm wrong on that, chat. But I'm pretty sure it is not on consoles. Which is unfortunate. I really, really thought that they would do that for part two. But they did not. At least not yet. You actually got Black Swan E1 in a single tin pool? Do you want to give me? Do you want to give me her? And you could just have, like, normal Black Swan and I can have you one? <laughs> Alright, sorry. Sorry, chat. No more stalling. Little baby Vita. Adorable. What's going on here? Such a wonderful day is perfect for inspection. Were they, were they both Righteous Vita? Okay, they were both Righteous Vita. Oh no, is it the same? Oh, it's the same. Okay. <laughs> I got you. It's the same Vita. Just hopping around. <laughs> In Phosphorus. Interesting. Cool name. I like, I really like the aesthetic of this place. Very cool. You're keeping your E1? No. We need Vita and Honkai Star L. Yeah, where's Flavor Vita? Righteous Vita. Dude, look at all the... Okay. So you know how last chapter I was talking about how incredible it was that they were actually doing more like camera shots and stuff like that? Uh, it looks like they took that and said, yeah, we're going to do that a lot more. <laughs> we're going to do it even more. <laughs> so cute. Oh, Red, you're too loud. Interesting. Colors. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Good job, Vita. <laughs> oh, with the guys, playable Vita's right here. What are you talking about? Y'all are all. We need playable Vita. She's right here, and she has the best walk animation I've ever seen in my life. 
Why does she hold her pinkies out like that? That's so adorable. <laughs> Look at her little pinky. Talk with the locals. Dude, look at this place. Very nice. Can I go over this here? I'm assuming it's going to block me off, but... We're going to try anyway. And then we're going to have to walk all the way back super slowly. Yep. <laughs> predictable. Absolutely predictable. Oh, so that's where the Klee animation got booted to. I forgot! <laughs> yeah, Klee did have a different walk animation, right? Is this... Oh, I thought it was Bigger Vita. Oh, wait, do you have red hair? Or is that brown? I can't tell. <laughs> oh my god. She's so adorable. <laughs> they just gave they just went absolutely ham on all of her animations, didn't they? Just to make her the cutest thing in the world. This place is giving Dr. Ratio vibes. <clears throat> yes, actually. Yes, they do have the same the same thing. Hoyo oh, NPCs have been fire recently? Yeah, I know. Especially the NPCs that I've seen in the trailer in some of the trailers for part two. Dude. Insane. <laughs> That's not the Vita we want playable. Why not? Come on now. Uh, asking a kid if they're too happy. Laud? Uh-huh. Help me? Pronunciation? Laudis? 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 Oh, Laudis. The kitty cat? <clears throat> no, not the cafeteria. Oh my god, Philo the goat. Yes, I would love some. As she spoke, Philo brought out a, is it, yes, um, brought out a plate of alluring golden delicacies. The sweet scent of honey captivated righteousness or righteous, not righteousness. <clears throat> um. I saw the message before you deleted it, Nelsie. I was actually going to bring it up. Is it what counts as the top part? Because isn't it more like a, like a, like a, like a one piece dress type of deal? Oh my god, they, dude. <laughs> they gave her so many animations. Oh, the top of the dress. I see. The little, I like the key. Locked herself in the basement. Wow, why are you be? Why are you bringing that up? <laughs> what if the cat lit itself on fire? Sounds like your works of art. Because there's a slit, and I'm not sure that's appropriate. Oh, right here. Oh, is that actually a window? I thought that was just a... Is it? Is that not just a... Like a fold? Like a cloth fold? It might be an opening. I didn't see it as an opening. If it is an opening, then that is kind of unfortunate. <clears throat> you can't rule out the... Wait. While Phosphorus has always been safe, you can't rule out the possibility of such fantastical events occurring. Like the cat setting itself on fire? Love that. Okay, so all the Vitas are actually being referenced by different colors. So Righteous is red. The inspiration here is, yes, yes, it is clearly Grease. Um, although I don't want to say this, I'm not planning on fixing the flower bed again. What happened to the flower bed? And also, again? <laughs> uh, okay, do we call her Righteous Vita or do we call her Red? I say we go by colors, because it's going to make it so much easier. Red, what did you do to the garden? Uh. <laughs> oh my god, so many Vitas. Cyan and purple. But the key covers it. That is true. The key does cover it. If it is an opening, yeah. 
I was only bedridden for mere three days. Aw, oh, yes, of course. Oh, being, only being bedridden for three days. Incredible. A smack to the forehead cut her words short. Fila gestured uh, to smack Righteous on the head and she immediately took a step back. Oh my god! Why are you abusing her? <laughs> oh, another one green? How many do we have now? <clears throat> we have red, orange, cyan, purple, green. We have five Vitas already. What is going on? たぶん、グリーンが君に説教ばかりしてるのは素直かどうかは関係ないと思うよ。はいはい、安心して。今日の僕はいつもと違って大人な観察官だからね。Now Righteous was about to leave, but as if suddenly remembering something, she leaned over and stuffed two pancakes in her mouth. Her cheeks puffed out much like a squirrel preparing for winter. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Literally stuffed two pancakes and immediately ran. She did not... <laughs> She did not wait at all. The most reckless Vita was appointed as Phosphorus Supervisor. Okay, so it's literally just a bunch of Vitas running this town? Yo, GPS? Yo, we got GPS in Greece? Let's go. Dude, I love the... I don't like the time thing. <laughs> the fact that we're dealing with so many time... Like, situations right now is ridiculous. <clears throat> Investigate. Investigate. Um, a solitary anklet lay on the ground. Its owner gone without a trace. Please don't tell me the cat actually set itself on fire. <laughs> that'll do it. That, that'll that do it. Honestly, I can't even... <laughs> I can't hate on Vita for doing that. I actually did that one time. I used... Okay, first of all, I'm very allergic to cats. But way back in the day, I had a cat. And it ran away. And I, I, I would write on... <laughs> this is gonna sound so sad. I would write on the sidewalk in chalk like come back <laughs> and i would walk around the the block <laughs> meowing like a cat the cat never came back it got eaten by a coyote <laughs> i'm laughing it's to hide the pain it's to hide the pain you like the grease theme too as you should let's go loudis <gasps> oh my god Look at that little cutie. Look at that little cutie. <laughs> L plus catless. <laughs> no. <laughs> hey, listen, I would have a cat if they didn't kill me. Okay. Cats actually obliterate my system now. Your family also did cat noises trying to get the cat's attention. Hey, did it ever work? <laughs> that was quite aggressive. Without warning, the cat swiped at Righteous. Oh, no. Taking her stumbling aback, the scratch left a burning pain. I'm going to attack the cat. I'm kidding. What happened last time? <laughs> <laughs> there was so much bounce to that one. <laughs> Normally, they don't bounce like that. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. So are all the colors not Vita then? Or maybe it's a Vita that goes by he. <laughs> if Blue were here, he'd probably make fun of me by saying, Is this what you meant by bonded? That is true. That is true, Vita. 
怖がらないで。僕のこと覚えてないの。She's such a sweetheart. 僕だよ。いつも煮干しを持ってくる。I'm safe from Pardo at least. Oh my god, that's so true. Wait, oh wait, I've never even thought about that. Chat, I love cat girls so much, but I'm so allergic to cats. Oh, whatever. I would have to just deal with the allergies. <laughs> I would just have to deal with the allergies. <laughs> so, Orange is the one that normally feeds. As if、uh, comprehending her words, the cat stopped struggling and stared at her warily. Please don't attack. Please don't attack again. Just as Righteous let out a sigh of relief, Lotus let out a shrill scream. In her moment of confusion, the cat darted past her like a flash of lightning. <sighs> allergy shots, Bandit, you'll get through in the name of love. I know. I've actually been thinking about getting the, the allergy shots, but they're so expensive. And also, you have to get them like, dude. Have you, have you guys ever looked into the allergy shots? It's crazy how often you have to get them. It's like when you first start, it's like two times a week for the first like, like two months or something. And then, like, obviously, over time, it slowly goes down. But、um, why is this music starting?、Um, after chasing Lotus' paw, paw prints for a while, Righteous came to an abrupt halt. Even depths and in a straight line. I'm going to assume that when it says even depths, they mean like same sh like stride length. Oh, you're saying that wasn't actually the real cat? Oh. Are you the most popular? <laughs> you guys have an actual ranking of Vitas? Even though she said that, she wasn't smiling anymore. Despite going on about helping the residents, an injury case,、um, even that of a cat, had not occurred in Phosphorus for centuries thanks to the joint effort of the Vitas. Uh oh. She hunched over, scrutinizing the、uh, plum. Am I having a stroke today? Okay, let's try this again, chat. <laughs> okay, let me turn my brain on. Okay, we're literate now. She hunched over, scrutinizing the plum blossom shaped prints on the ground. After a while, she noticed a faint reddish brown tinge on a slightly deeper print. Is it bleeding? The cat's bleeding? Who attacked the cat, dog? This is so sad. <clears throat> Oh, so it varies? That makes sense. A good friend of mine was thinking about getting the shots, and they told me about that. Yeah, yeah. So, like, the, the longer you do it, the less often you have to get the shots. So, I think it's like a year in, you only have to go in like once every couple months. And then a couple years in, it's like once every like half year, every six months or something like that.、Um, her question was answered sooner than expected. <gasps> she found what? A knife? What did she find? <laughs> Who hurt the cat? Erudite Vita? Oh. A man. A man. I haven't heard a man talk in so long. <laughs> Pedro. The bedridden elder gestured toward the vacant short cabinet beside the bed. Oh, is this the instant? I'm going to assume this is the instance. The last instance of someone getting injured. <gasps> Does she have different hair? Do they actually give the different models different hair to help differentiate them? Triple conjoined words are weird because you're not supposed to have two hyphens. I, I, I mess up on them every single time. <laughs> every single time. This Vita is a boy? Oh, is this the one? Oh, yes. Oh, I see, I see. 
Um, Erudite and blue are male are male Vs with shorter hair. Okay, I got you. I got you. Yeah, so so what I said earlier was correct. It was actually because the pronouns, I pointed it out. Um, the words that slipped out were now stuck on the tip of his tongue. He stood somewhat awkwardly in place, unsure of how to respond. <laughs> oh my dear. <laughs> I'm wondering about the little about the little thing right here the normal Vita didn't have that did she? I can't remember <clears throat> sorry I'm going to reread this while I was bedridden due to illness, it was all thanks to your frequent visits, bringing me meds and meals that I was able to recover my spirits so quickly. So I'm going to assume this is in another bubble world. Interesting though, if it is. <clears throat> Why there's so many, so many vitas. Goated. Bro, chat. When someone is telling you a story, like a stranger, bro, sometimes, if you listen to that story, it's pretty epic. It's pretty cool. I actually had uh, the CEO of a, um, of a cafe come in um, the other day to my shop, and... I was the only one that was working. Like, I was the only one there. My Because I worked with my dad, and he was, like, out doing sign installations. And uh, it wasn't busy that day. So he came in, and he was shipping out a bunch of, like, coffee stuff. And I asked him, I was like, what are you shipping this out to? Uh, and then that's when he, we ended up having a whole back and forth conversation. And that's where he told me that he was the CEO uh, of the, the little, like, like coffee uh, company. And then I asked him, like, how he started it, why he started it, like, all that stuff. Very interesting story. And then he gave me two free cards to come to the cafe and I can get any drink for free. <laughs> Very epic. Very cool. At the registrar. Love that word. Dude, again with the, the little like like mannerisms. They're so fluid. And there's so much there's so I oh, do I can't speak. There's a plethora of more animations <laughs> than normal. Being the eyes of the city. Huh. So not everyone in Phosphorus is a Vita. Interesting. <laughs> does the pinky still does the pinky still go out? Yeah, it does. <laughs> well, a correction. I guess the pinky doesn't go out. It's more like the other fingers go in, but the pinky doesn't. <laughs> anyway. This place looks so sick. And this dude has the same incredible eyes. This might be the same NPC, just wearing different clothes. But, um, look at that. Look at the eyes. I love the color. What's up? Oh, Zion. Oh, I didn't look at the price of the tomatoes. 12... 12 what? $12 for one tomato? What kind of inflation has happened in Phosphorus? あ、朝っぱらから騒ぎで起きてしまったからな。いっそのこと太陽を浴びに行こうかなって思ってた。あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ
地震じゃなかったの違う違う俺は夜明け前から起きてるが地震なんてなかったぞ Question mark? Interesting でも町の向こう側から変な足音がずっと聞こえてきてるんだ足音ああ音がかなり響いてて、しかも長いまるで数百人が一斉に走ってるみたいだ That would be terrifying <laughs> If you live in an area that doesn't have that many people and then you woke up just sounding like there were hundreds of people running もしかして運動会とかを開催する予定があるのかそれは Or maybe there's more people here than I thought 一番情報が早い記録員ですら聞いたことがないなら俺それにしても Oh, okay, bye. See you later. See you later, Andy. His name was Andy, right? I'm pretty sure his name was Andy. <clears throat> 15.2. What? How much? How much is that in, in actual money? Hello. You're pretty as well. Oh, cute ass name. Oh, <laughs> cute ass name. Being addressed as Sir Cyan by a woman who looked uh who looked a good ten years older didn't seem to ruffle erud it's erudite, right? As if he had long grown accustomed to it. He recounted all he had just heard to the woman before him. Uh oh, did you hear Did each person experience something different? Question mark. Did you wake up early? そんな町の食堂で働いてる私はいつも他の住民たちより早く起きてるでしょ What did you experience, だから彼らが話してたようなことは絶対に起きてないって保証できるわでも確かに変な音は聞こえたわねしかもずっと続いてたのは、like、少し重くてまるでパンチジをグーで叩くような音だったわ So still a bunch of that <laughs> Footsteps or fist pounding. <laughs> I really like the name. Siru? I pronounced that so wrong, but still. Very, very cute name. <clears throat> I love that we can't run. Dude! Where's the bridge over there? Oh, uh, you know what? If they have GPS, they probably have technological bridges. <laughs> I'm sure it rises out of the ground. I was like, how do you get over there? What, what if the time stops ticking? And what about you, mister? What did you hear today? It's the haters pounding sand. <laughs> Me when I'm working on any video ever. <laughs> Uh -oh. Some of the Vitas are missing? Okay. Okay, what did you hear? Oh, bro, saw something? <laughs> Dude, the first one with evidence. Let's go. Oh, the pillar fell over. Hello? Who knocked over the pillar? Actually, the better question is why was there a random pillar? Was it just standing up here? Because what an odd place to put a pillar. <laughs> the stone pillar among the many buildings in Phosphorus was one that Erudite had passed by countless times. However, now its upper section was gone and the remaining section was covered in cracks, giving the impression that it would crumble at the slightest touch. Oh? Bro took a picture of it? Erudite took out his camera and quickly snapped a few photos. Then he tiptoed to carefully examine the cracks and breaks in the pillar. The more he checked, the more bewildered he looked. Every building and decoration here had withstood the test of hundreds of even thousands of years. Even if it was really hit by an earthquake, it wouldn't likely have suffered as such. Someone's deliberately destroying phosphorus. <clears throat> Uh, earthquakes, footsteps, and the sound of pounding. Erudite dared not to dwell on it any further. If he was correct, how colossal would the monster be? Oh. 
bro thinks it's a Honkai beast. Erudite's smile calmed the young man down. <laughs> oh no, I'm sure it's nothing, dog. Don't even worry about it. Just go back to your stand. We'll deal with it. <laughs> Big nod. After confronting the young man and seeing him off, a slightly helpless expression replaced the smile on Erudite's face. No matter how much he tried to con uh, console himself, he couldn't bring himself to believe that everything he saw was solely caused by years of neglect. <laughs> Detective Erudite over here, let's go. We have another... We're starting off the next arc as a detective again. That's so funny. Also, Ayo. Little, little in-game cinematic. Oh no, it was a Honkai Beast. Oh no. As he approached the source of the sound... Although, someone clearly just obliterated the... <laughs> someone tossed that Honkai Beast like trash. As he approached the source of the sound, he couldn't help but hold his breath. However, when he finally laid eyes on what was in front of him, he cried out in surprise. Hello? Oh, it... <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Fu -hua. Fu -hua. <laughs> Erudite's like, oh my god. You're the most attractive person here. <laughs> Me too. Me too, Erudite. Dude, the classic Honkai models. Look at that. <laughs> Encompassing Vita. <clears throat> okay, I will say, I'm actually surprised that one of the things that they didn't change on the models was the color of the band. I know they're changing the, like, this part. The little, like, uh, I get is that the straps? The straps and then the actual color of the gym they're changing for each Vita. But I'm surprised the actual, like... Like, banned. I guess that'd be too much. <clears throat> Since time in. Okay, so. So they're not actually kids then. Correction. I mean, they obviously are. They're acting like kids, but they've been around for a long time. Oh. Uh, please. Let's go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, it wasn't Fuhua. Got a shield. Let's go. Ah. Skill demos. <laughs> They're like, hey guys, you ever played Fuhua before? She's kind of different. <laughs> Fun fact, if I remember correctly, in British law, time immemorial is about 70 years. 70 years? Really? That's such a weird... Like... Why 70? <laughs> you can tap the skill demo button in the upper left uh, in a battle to see the current battle suit's command inputs and demo videos. They actually have demo videos too? That's actually so funny. Let's take a gander. <laughs> okay. I love it. That's actually so funny that they had to do this. Yep. Yep. Love it. Love it. Bonk. How much SP do you need for old? Is it 75? Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> right at the end. <laughs> I split into five. <clears throat> 
Oh, oh, hello, click, click. Look at the little wave. <laughs> The time it takes for no one to remember. Time unmemorized. Oh! Wait, that's actually... Why does that sound so badass? <laughs> what? Not a lot can be done several times in a row with 75, I think. Oh, interesting. Okay. I thought you needed 75. Uh, thanks for coming in time. After crushing those Honkai beasts, effort... Dude, look how gorgeous she is. Uh, effortlessly, the mysterious warrior took out something like a pocket watch, examining it thoroughly. The portal terminal on the cosmic juggernaut lay silent in Fu Hua's hand. It's, uh, it's a hand still. It was also devoid of any damage or interference. I joined to see a baby face vanity? Yes, sorry, I got rid of the beard. <laughs> Don't worry, it'll be back at some point. She let out a small sigh and stowed the terminal away. The girl she had rescued moments ago watched her closely, a mix of curiosity and confusion on her face. Hey, no problem. There was Honkai. I had to beat the ass. <laughs> a truly impressive fighter is an understatement, but yes. <laughs> You should call her orange. Okay, got you. Right, the colors. Okay, so um, Erudite's the one that had the, 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 the barrier, right? The shielding. I wonder if they all have different powers. It's touring your profession. <laughs> Actually, I think I was kidnapped here, but... Yeah. <laughs> An ordinary tourist. Are we getting a... Oh. Another stage. A few days ago. I was going to say, are we getting a flashback? What? Did, wait. Did Sinti banish Fuwa here? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> How can there be someone as indecisive as you? Lee Fuwa Fu has some of the best outfits in existence, dog. Look at her. She is so hot. <laughs> this is going to be a problem, chat. How am I supposed to focus on the story when Fu is on screen 24-7 in this arc? <laughs> <laughs> a housewarming gift. Actually, you know what? A housewarming gift would be nice, Sinti. Ah, yes. See? Spoken like someone with true immortality. <laughs> you just gotta stay there for super long. And actually learn the town. <laughs> Such an old timer. Don't worry, no expect no expectations of focus here. <laughs> oh no. Brick. Hey, I'm gonna need that fan art. I'm gonna need that fan art. It's no wonder you complain every single day. <laughs> no, no. It wasn't inconsiderate. Maybe it was inconsiderate for Sinti to agree. <laughs> Fuwa, you do not need to apologize for this. Oh my god, you're such a sweetheart. お年寄りらしい生活をこのむとでも。あのね、もうとっくに飽きてますよ。本当に過ぎます。じゃあ、ええ。違うんです。もういい。道同じからざ。お、オッケー、バイ。ためにはからず。See you later, Sinti.
And just like that. <gasps> I know she was in the thumbnail, but still, it's very, it's very cool actually seeing um Fushi back. Book of Fushi. Fuhua is very kind, of course. Of course she is. She's such a cutie. I love her hair in this outfit. Oh my god. Fuhua. Gorgeous. Gorgeous in every single ever. Everywhere. Hey, on your own, we're here too. She'll come back when she wants to. Oh. <laughs> so Look how cute. She realized that it was just an angry outburst and that she wasn't for realsies. Hey. <laughs> She's just epic. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. She... Dude. This outfit is so good. It's literally so good. もう少ししたら、<laughs> Nice little time pass. Hey. 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 Imagine just sleeping in caves all the time. That would be awful. <laughs> you like the hair buns? The hair buns are really well done. Oh my god. That is... So cute. It's okay, you're awake now. Oh, what? Clan of those doctors from now on, I can always be with you? Question mark? Yo, Klein fixed battery issue? <laughs> was there an event? Oh my god, there probably was an event, huh? Did I miss an, an event on this? <laughs> She's been asleep since Spring Fest manga. This is so heartwarming. So many delicious foods. Oh my god. <laughs> the murmurings of... Uh, oh, I can't read again. The murmurings of the Book of Fushi grew fainter, uh, eventually giving way to soft snoring. Fuhua chuckled gently and tucked the blanket around her once more. So cute, oh my god. Yet, yet, hyphen. At that moment, a strange feeling bubbled up in Fu Hua's heart. And she was teleporting. Oh. Hello? <laughs> Fu Hua can hear narrator. Oh, <laughs> legitimately Fu Hua can hear narrator. <laughs> No one answered. Just when Fuhua thought she had misheard, a voice similar to the book of Fushi's began to narrate again. Oh no! Not, not the Fuhua becoming... 
fourth wall sentient. <laughs> She cast another glance at the Book of Fushi, who was still sleeping soundly, then got up and walked towards the door. Hello? <gasps> Chat. Okay, now that we're actually in game, can we talk about Fuhua's walk? <laughs> oh my god. The power strut. Look at that. She's an immortal. She's spent centuries mastering this walk animation. Centuries, I tell you. <laughs> Door. Wait. There's no blanket over her. Where is the blanket? Tuck her in. <laughs> Book of Fushi was sound asleep, oblivious of the anomaly earlier. Door. Oh. Wow, this isn't eerie at all. Oh, and the thunder? Oh, they even got the... Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. They got the lightning and everything. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh, is she ready? She stands up against the lightning, bro. God damn. They got the atmosphere here. Oh no, not more with the color red. Not the red doors. We just dealt with red doors. Dude, the sound design in this chapter is incredible. Already. Oh, cube. Why cube? Cubes are not good. ふかは思わずよく知っているなかまのことを思い出す。好きの律者。帰ってくるのは静寂のみ。その静けさに彼女の心はますます喜ぶ。ハッシュ<笑><笑> yes, <笑> To see through people's hearts. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, chat. Um, I did not know that Fuhua thought that Sue was not alive. Cause wait, when did that happen? When did that happen in the in the manga? How long has Sue been stuck in the little thingy? In the little like with whatever god deity is playing chess with that man. <clears throat> That's right, it was the second key manga. After second key, Dudu would have brought uh, brought back info. Okay, interesting. Interesting, interesting. I definitely thought Fuhua still thought that that Sue was, like, alive. Amidst the boundless uh, darkness, Fuhua seemed to be confronting herself. <笑>無遊病ではなく私が自身の心と会話しているわけでもなくしかしその瞬間あ、そんなに <笑> Can we get this Fuhua to appear in Honkai Star Rail, please? Hey, whatever martial law we're gonna get in Star Rail is gonna go crazy. And that might actually be my first, like, my, the first character that I will pull for Edelons in, in the Star Rail, like, for realsies. Um, could it be that the voice is attempting to steer my thoughts? その考えが生まれた瞬間 
負荷の心臓は勢いよく跳ね上がったまずい No, something is clearly not right for Wall <laughs> Oh no Giving my girl a migraine Oh, and then she got teleported here Fuka san, sumi masen どう話すべきかを考えていました簡単に言うと私は2人の友人と一緒に旅行をしていたのですが少し予想外の出来事が起きて目覚めたらここにいたのですところで2人はこんな女の子を見かけていませんか身長はこのくらいで。She's about this tall. Okay, so question, chat. When she said she's about this tall, do you think she actually said like, like from the ground up to here, or do you think she actually gave like, like ball, bottom of ball to top of head height, <laughs> or are we talking like floor to top of floating height? <laughs> the two Vitas exchanged glances and shook their heads. <laughs> Okay. Oh, the gym on the key is different as well. I did not notice that. I see, I see. So, the Mosoda. I tell of Tarino Kodomodashi. Cocono Tatemono Yafuso Miru Kangiri. Carera Nitote, Watashua Witi Rui Hojin to Itatokoro de Show. You would say that you did the right size just then. <laughs> Bookapushi isn't big. Yeah, yeah, I know. I was just like, is it from floor to top of floating? Or bottom of ball to top of head? <clears throat> Considering the architecture and fashion styles here, I must look like an outsider to them. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, do they have different names for them or do they just call them monsters? Yeah, what do you call them? Oh, 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 wait, no, no, no. So did they arrive with Fuwa then? Because they said that no one's been injured in like centuries, right? Hell yeah. Let's do it. You, you have to say yes. You saw how badass she was. Come on now. The Vitas exchanged a silent glance, and after a moment of hesitation, they seemed to reach a consensus. Let's go. Huge W. I love how committed they are to the head nod. Official partners. Oh my god. Screenshot. Um, as she spoke, Fuhua couldn't help but uh, couldn't help but sigh mentally. Where did those Vitas buy their outfits? I want to buy one and join them. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure if you just look up ancient Greece outfits on Amazon, <laughs> you'll find something similar. The long game. 43 cleared. Oh wow, we're almost done with Act 1. Holy shit. <gasps> bah, 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 bah. Oh! <laughs> I love how she just tours herself into a torpedo. <laughs> or as fragile as toys. Yeah, what can I say? I'm just a badass. <laughs> Isn't that so funny? Archangels is such a cool name for the lowest form of Honkai Beast. Hot topic? Yeah, you might find one there too. <laughs> What is it, Mushroom? What is it? We just started streaming. There's no way you need to go outside right now. There's no way. I refuse to believe it. There's no way. I refuse to believe it. Dude, she's so knowledgeable. Oh my god, love that. So experienced, for real. She's like, ah, oh, I don't even worry about it. The birth of Honkai beasts tend to follow a specific pattern. As long as we can find out the cause of their birth and eliminate the source. Things shouldn't be bad. 
<laughs> Biblically accurate. Archangels weren't actually at the top of the rankings. Oh, yeah. Here's the fun part. Yeah. Yeah, I actually have zero knowledge of the Bible. <laughs> so that is actually interesting to me. Um, I definitely also uh, took love of the imaginary tree and overall lore. Interesting. Hey, come here. Stop. Come here. Chill out. Chill out. <laughs> Curly's going crazy for no reason right now. Oh, follow Erudite. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I wasn't paying attention. Oh my god, she's so fast. Oh, wait, no, sorry. Erudite's he. He's so fast. Hey, what's up? Oh, I thought I saw you already run over here. <clears throat> Did you just... No, different. Other one. Weakness mechanics! Fuwa can easily see through enemy weaknesses. The color of we uh, enemies' weaknesses floats above the enemies. Deal same element damage to quickly break it and gain benefits. Um, weakness burst. Breaking a weakness causes an explosion that damages nearby enemies. Breaking a weakness creates a black hole under the enemy that pulls... Oh, I see. Weakness... Oh, okay. The different types. Burst, focus, and charge. Her united heart points... Oh, I'm a different Fuwa now. Wait, is there a lore reason as to why I'm switching between the different Fuwas right now? Uh, Fuwa accures, accrues, accrues, mm, I wish I was literate. United heart points in battle. When full, she can activate united heart mode. Um, it will break, oh, she gets to just change? Wait, I can change on the fly? Is that what I'm looking at? The three different types of United Heart mode have different skill effects. Okay. Nice. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh, we're gaming. Oh, we're gaming so hard. Bonk. Bonk. I love the animation of the... Of the, uh... <laughs> infinite kicks. Demo. A cruise. Yes, a cruise. Thank you. Valkyrie Soko no Ketai wa Gaibu no Chikara no Ekyo de Totsu Henka. Oh, oh, she is. No, no. The force field just now. What exactly? Okay, so she is realizing that she's changing battle suits. Fuka san, Daijobu. Eh. Watashini tote, Koita Hokaiju, a Tenguai, I tell you, I yes, never. I'm sure they can sense it. Come on now. No? Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, she could see the system. The system. It's weird how technologically, like, advanced they are right here. He opened his palms as he spoke, and a pure white hollow screen manifested between his hands. Oh, they got cameras everywhere? Oh, no live updates? Okay, sick. Looking at the little, uh, at the shy little boy seriously and diligently explained his work, Fu Hua chuckled internally and wanted to encourage this overly humble child. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> hold on, hold on. That's not what Red said. Red said something completely different. <laughs> They're so nice to each other. Oh my god. The little kick. The <laughs> I love the little kick. What does it stand for? To the creation, 
創世神話まで遡るんだだから Interesting. As for the suspicious aspects, Fuhua decided to observe some more before drawing any conclusions. <laughs> They're just babies, I know. Fuhua, do you feel the beast? Yeah, 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 yeah. I was gonna say, can you, can you feel the energy anyway? そうですねそれは高次元空間から来るエネルギーで崩壊のコメントもありますあ、そうですね崩壊に関する事件を徹底的に解決したいなら<笑>でも今辿ってきたルートから考えると私たちはすでにトルスを一周して調べたはずだけど待ってまだ調べていない場所が Yeah, the, the tower area, the clock, the little clock thing That's been. That has no bridge leading to it.、うん、<laughs> that must be what you're talking about, surely. <laughs> Fu was like. Detective. Yeah. You're good. Go do what you need to do. You're the host. <laughs> See her smile? <laughs> so cute. Oh wow, look at that scene change. Tari wa momete iru yo desu. Nani ka iye nai jijo de maru no de shou ka. Arguing? Are they for realsies arguing or are they like arguing? <clears throat> yeah, those statues are sick. Antique na ikoku fu no tate. Retro, exotic architecture. <laughs> so weirdly detailed compared to everything else. Machi no mitame kara wa. Right, right. That's what I'm saying. Oh my god, Fuhua is literally repeating everything that I pointed out. Not on Earth. Ayo. Are we on Mars? Or. A thought struck Fuhua, yet had slipped away before she could catch it. She was about to chew on the last vestiges of the idea when she heard Vita speak beside her. Oh, hello. The city's museum. Okay. So, not that. Or, unless that is news. I doubt it, but. Miss <laughs> Miss Fu. Miss Fu. Let's go. Access to the museum. Relatively close space, okay. Look at Fu Hua's brain going crazy. Records of the, of the history beyond the city. It is interesting.、Uh, I guess.、Uh, what was the dude's name? Pedro? He mentioned the earthquake, right? Oh, but I guess he was the only one that mentioned the earthquake. The other ones didn't. I was gonna say, are earthquakes like actually normal here? Or.、Um, Erudite appeared somewhat uneasy, but still looked into Fuhua's eyes sincerely, and so she smiled back、Arigatou、softly. Gozaimasu. His usual awkwardness fl、uh, flickered in his eyes. Eventually, he only looked down and nodded lightly. <laughs> I would do the same if Fuhua said that to me. Why, oh no. Why, oh no. What's up? Encompassing Vita. Oh, the museum is underground. We need to unlock the gate and then open the hidden door behind the gate. Oh my god. Have you ever unlocked it? 
Oh, 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 we need to light up the torches, guys. Come on, I can already see it. There's two lit up, one not lit up. Oh, come on, let's go puzzle hunting. I used to do Easter egg hunting in Call of Duty Zombies. We got this. We got this. Come on, let's use... Oh, and now I'm Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> Camera change, and now I'm Phoenix. <laughs> Burn combustible objects that appear during exploration. Can also blow fuses and destroy circuits in some places. When necessary, a red tip will appear during conversations or mission guidance. Okay, sick. I can punch things with my with my fists. Punch. Did that turn off any of them? It did not. Fist! Oh, I don't know why it changed my direction. Okay, my fist is on cooldown. Bah! Hey guys, it's open. And now I'm no longer Phoenix. <laughs> yeah, thanks. No biggie. Easter egg hunting and caught zombies that text me back? Hey, that's what I... Dude, that was my thing. I love doing Easter eggs and caught zombies. Oh, look at this place. Oh my god, so pretty. It's the place. It is the place. After solving the gate's mechanism, the three of them opened the trapdoor and entered the museum. All the water. To do some maintenance. Interesting. Okay, so the other Vitas do know how to get in. Is this where they're going to be like, um, we're not children? Oh, we're getting a- oh. There are seven of you. Okay. I counted five, I think, before. What are the other two colors? Righteous Vita. Red. Look. <laughs> T-posing. <laughs> a bit too passionate. Orange. Oh, yellow. Okay. Voracious. Voracious. Definition of voracious. Speaking or representing the truth. Okay. That is not at all what I thought that word meant. Uh, she's a really sincere person. I think she can be described as pure or innocent. Cute. The disciplined Vita Green. The judge. <laughs> I'm sure you all have a cute side. Don't even worry about it. Erudite Vita, Cyan, and the mindful Vita Blue. Smarter and more mature. There's one more. Orange <laughs> <laughs> Calling him out. <laughs> Harmonious Vita. Purple. Purple. Celebrations and events in the city. I want to meet Harmonious Vita. I love purple. Oh. Wait. It's the color of the rainbow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Why did it take me so long to realize this? So they're all shade. They're like what? They're all. Is this gonna be like a? They're all shades of one Vita. Like a like a, a Raven situation in Teen Titans. A raven and all the different colored uh, all the different colored hoods, and they were all represented like different emotions. <clears throat> you guys remember that episode? Teen Titans are epic. <laughs> you are colorblind. Leave me alone. <laughs> Who said you could bring that up? Who? Not me. Not me. Play voice message. Oops. 
I just scanned with my eyes. Um, view description, play voice message. Uh, let's read the description first. There was nothing in the display case. Nice description. Uh, one hereby witness all sufferings to prove the worlds are infinite. Oh, fun. Let's do that again. One hereby witness all sufferings to prove the worlds are infinite. Okay, and it's empty. Investigate the goods. Incredible. <laughs> you could sell that exhibit for 20 million dollars because it's so special. The museum has existed since the city was established. Okay, so did you know the fountain? Did you know the city's fountains? Are you that old or no? <laughs> the little the little jog over here. Guys, your feet are in the ground. You guys do realize you're stuck in the ground right now, right? That is awful. I'm so sorry. Look at their little jog. <laughs> oh my god. See you later, suckers. Look, they're gonna they're gonna teleport over here. What the hell is this? A strangely designed clock made extremely skillfully. Voice message. The exhibit was named Farewell. Oh, can I read all the exhibits? Oh, <laughs> I was going to the waypoint. My bad. It's three minutes slower. I, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to actually skip the exhibits. <laughs> I will go back and look at them. <laughs> I just skipped the entire thing. <laughs> why would why would they have the waypoint all the way over there? Okay, uh odd ass voice. And the and thus the sky split open and the earth crumbled. Is this not... Is that not... The Theater of Domination speaking? Or like, similar voice? Three months of analysis? Hey, yo. The body I bear is the remains of calamity. Look at this little, little fish tank. And the fishes in it were still swimming. Love it. The voice message. Freedom. <laughs> the, this beautiful life form, what the fish? Oh. Okay, damn. Alright. Just like pearls are always set in crowns. <laughs> what a way to say it. Oh my god. Only a beautiful cage can ensure their future. I missed the description? No, wait, did I? <clears throat> Was it? You were saying the, the three months? That it was an analysis for three months? Or was that the voice message? Oh. 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 
I'm about to sink this fish tank into the ocean in between people's visits. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, okay. We're kind of going with some Doki Doki vibes here. Scattered stones fragmented, uh, fragments mixed with some metal scraps. It's hard to tell what this exhibit meant. Oh, under the abyss. Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. A lot of, okay. Sea of Quanta, question mark. Under the abyss. <clears throat> Drowning it in the sea. This is not an exhibit. That's a triangle. That is quite literally okay. A cloud of shapeless mist. One could seemingly feel a trace of energy pulsing within it. The exhibit was named Seed. Right, right. Uh, oh, whoops. I meant to change the... Oh, heck. Oh, heck. Chat, where else do they do this voice... Like effect. Was it? I don't like the. I don't like the. I don't like the. The, the, the cut out parts of the script. <laughs> the cataclysm took everything along with solution. My friends, my past, my everything. The Cataclysm. Um... I'm trying to remember. Was there... Um... I don't think... I don't think it is. Because it looked different before, right? But... In the world that Saw... Where we actually played as Saw, not Vita, but like the actual Saw. Uh... In the flashbacks before... Like when her and, um... Oh, uh, what was her name, chat? The one, the one, like, researcher that was with Saw that actually, like, gave her some shit. <clears throat> Did they have a museum? Did they talk about the museum? The walking around stuff? <laughs> yeah, we did just walk around with her, but... Like, before before they, like, opened up the world to the, to the, to the abyss. Yeah. I don't think we're on... I don't think we're actually on Mar, right? Mariah? Yes. I'm pretty sure that was her name. Yes, I think that is her. Um, do you like my new appearance now on? I'll be living with this dignified look. <laughs> and something. Bumpkin! Bumpkin. <laughs> I know, Mushroom. I'll let you out in just a second, girly. I let you out right before stream. We're not even. We're not even two hours in. Why do you need to go out so bad, huh? Did I already read the description? I don't remember if I did. A pumpkin with a smiley face drawn on it. Yeah, I'm trying to think. Um, Gordy, Gordy. Um, because I don't think we're actually on. <clears throat> on the other planet. I know Fuhua's suspicious if we're not on Earth, which I guess we're not on Earth, but I don't think we're on Saw's planet. A strangely designed clock made extremely skillfully. I were looking at this one again because I said so. And also because the waypoint is here. Um, investigate the goods. This is into 12 hours. Oh, isn't divided into 12 hours. Is it only into three? A clock in base 15? 
数百年前によく使われてた時計こういう時計はしばらく経つと誤差が出てくるから明らかにおかしい時は調整して組み立て直さなくちゃいけないの、huh. Interesting. 今はもうほとんどつそういうことだったのですねでもこの上にあるメモリが15になっているのはなえ<笑>意味 Yeah, is what's the, what the purpose, the reason? Tokunimiwa Naito mo Tokewa Tore mo koda yo. Fuwa, just as confused as me. Let's go. Book with a pen. Is that a stylus? What's up? Description. Uh oh! Uh oh! The letter V. The exhibit was named Wither. Okay, so this exhibit was clearly actually left by Vita Vita. We already listened to the voice pitch for the clock. Or at least originally. We did, when we first came over here. Just like how I like my own name. Okay, interesting. So. Uh, I'm trying to think of. Yeah, yeah, because it was three minutes slower. Yeah, yeah, we, we, yeah, we listened to that one. Um, another cube that I can't the exhibit had no caption or explanation. Odd. Bigger picture book. <gasps> it has the little Vitas! A thick book filled with postcards uh, for every annual commemoration. The exhibit was named Commemoration Postcards Collection. Cute. Very cute. What is up with me being able to inspect this? Does this actually do anything? Mysterious manuscript by the cabinet. Mushroom, can you please stop? Oh, there's a body in that. What am I looking at? Um, thesis. Kinematics of a particular small planet. Abstract. 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 17, 19. 2 times 3, 2 times 5, 2 times 7. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Author J.M. This extraordinary sequence of natural numbers have led us to all our conclusions in the thesis. Okay. After finishing reading the manuscript in front of the exhibit in confusion. Oh. In the dim light, that person or exhibit had his upper body concealed in darkness. <laughs> Jimmy Mujuan. <laughs> but even now, Fuhua can still easily find his visage from the depths of her memory. Along with the pouring rain that day. Okay, first of all, love the backdrop. Our other detective. Oh? What? Was I supposed to know who that body was for realsies? If someone didn't happen to be after me as well, it'd have been quite difficult for me to play the prey and lure you into this trap. Don't tell me that. <laughs> Why? Did, okay, you guys say that so often. <laughs> Dude, villain, villain line number one. Time for everything to end. <laughs> Moriarty? It's Sampo? I mean, Sparkle. Yeah, 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 of course. Fuwa stared intensely at the figure within the display case. The latter only stood motionless within the case, like a wax statue. Um, where's the text? 
Hello? What? What? Dog? <laughs> what? Wait, 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 wait. Is this a glitch or is this how it's supposed to be? Chat. <laughs> is this a bug? Yeah, Fuhua has some, Fuhua has some baddies. You're back, welcome back, Bessie, welcome back. Strange? Strange? Was that, okay, what did I, so did I actually miss a line there? That's so weird. Yeah. ですが、当時の状況は少し特殊でしたから簡単に彼を純粋な悪人だと定義することはできません。I <clears throat> uh, for him crimes weren't wrongdoings but rather commendable arts. You're watching me from the show floor of the Smash Bros. Terminant? Dog. What? <laughs> hey, are you competing or no? <laughs> are you competing or no? No. <laughs> His intelligence eventually became his downfall. Um, I am trying to remember. Moriarty. Am I dumb? Why is this name not ringing a bell? Huh. Moriarty. No, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. Everything she's explaining sounds like Otto, but I don't remember the name Moriarty. Eh? <laughs> The guy from the thing? He's the guy who did things. Oh, what? He's the guy who did things? We clashed indirectly several times, which culminated in a fight to the death. Okay. Fuwa closed her eyes and let out a soft sigh. The Vita shook their heads. No, you're good. Don't even worry about it. Uh, Fuwa shook her head as she gazed um, at the figure inside the display case that flickered with the light. A hint of concern crawled up her face. Mushroom, please give me one second. I'll let you out in just a moment, please. <clears throat> um, I'm not, actually. I'm not, Marty. Moriarty is Sherlock's rival slash opponent in the novels. Keep that in mind. Got you? Okay. Understood, understood. Thank you for, for educating me, chat. Uh, spoilers. That means he's not the guy who didn't do things. Oh my god. So true. Why would you guys tell me? Oh my god. Take a look at other exhibits? Yeah, let's do it. Let's take a look at the other exhibits. What's this one? This is a feather. 
I have witnessed eternity bloom in a blink. Uh, maybe you forgot, but Fuhua was the Watson to the Honkai verse Sherlock Holmes. I, I did say I did say that she was being uh, a detective earlier anyway. <laughs> Um, it was the radiance of freedom which certain uh, pompous, bloated creatures were undeserving of. Terrifying. Uh, description. A beautiful feather that looked like a peacock's. Yep. Yeah, like, you know. The exhibit was named Moment. Yeah, uh, Vita's peacock form. Vita's pe peacock form. Uh, that is... That is the moon rock. Oh, that's it. <laughs> that's the entire voice message. View description. A hideous piece of meteorite. What makes it hideous? The exhibit was named Sprout. Mm-hmm. It was the right. Uh, wait, was that another? Ah, okay, so it's not a bug then. This is intentional. This is intentional. This is intentional. Okay, epic. Tell me the history. And then, Terrifying. Oh, wait, it's the thing. It is, it is. <laughs> It is the prologue. <笑>はやしが茂り、水が音を奏でる。魚が光を誘い、スズメが安眠を与える。だが、白昼は凍りを刺さ。インディーズ、ザ・ティング。国家は静寂に包まれた。幾千万、また幾千万の注意が。It's not intended, you don't think? It just happens? Oh. Interesting. <clears throat> okay, so I was supposed to see that when we first started, right? This isn't a legend. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no, no. This is not a legend. <laughs> okay, perfect. The certainty in Vita's voices surprised Fuhua. They played twice, okay. Well, you could blame it on the fact that they're children and maybe they just believe it, but... They, they do be for real seeds, probably. Two distinctive individuals. Um... Saw... And that Moriarty, yeah. Oh! When Fuwa was lost in thought, a bell rang out in the museum. Oh no. More Honkai Beast? Question mark? Alarmed, the two Vitas exchanged a look, their faces revealing a sense of panic. Something big must have happened in the city. Okay, so another Honkai Beast. <laughs> oh, look at all the Fuwas. Oh, Mind Lake feathers and orange flavored candy. My favorite. I'm assuming we use these to actually level up the thing. Tab, uh, tap the tabs above to switch between different game modes. Let's try a side story first. Side stories consist of multiple branches. Uh, different choices will lead you to different endings. Okay. Interesting. 
Let's try Derived Disaster now. And Derived Disaster, there'll be new commissions daily. Complete them and get lots of rewards. Uh, chat, is there lore here? Uh, there are also side missions to do in between the acts. Up to you if you do them. I recommend them, though. Is there actually lore in them? Like, for realsies lore in them? Or is it just, like, whatever? In side missions, yes, there is. Okay. But not this thing? Not the derived disaster? I got you. Yeah, I mean, if there's lore in the side story, then yeah, we'll, we'll do it. We'll do it. That's daily farm. Come over quick. I've already stood guard for the whole day. We can't let that culprit escape. Hot pursuit. Ain't you a fast runner? Get moving now. Oh, oh. We actually get to, like, do it, do it. Uh, okay. In that case, give me one second. Because Mushroom is, like, dying to go outside for some reason. Even though we just went out. So, one moment... And then we will continue. BRB and like, honestly, like four minutes. So if you need to go get like a drink or go to the bathroom, not drive disaster, but in the side missions. Okay. Um, and now's your chance. Uh, it's not going to be super long. So I will be right back. I will be right back.
Oh, okay. It wasn't a glitch. <clears throat> it's weird the playback icon shows there. Yeah, it was more like... It, yeah, I don't know. The way that it was, like, set up was weird. But, yeah. I mean, I guess I'm not surprised that there was actually nothing there. Alrighty. Alrighty. Let us continue. Let us continue. Uh, let me unpin that. We're good to go. I actually remember to unpin the message this time. Um, come over quick. Alright, let's do it. If this means more combat with Fuhua battle suits, we are in. That kid on the street. The commotion had passed. The street was now empty, and a spitfire of a girl stood in the middle of the road. Um, hands on her hips, looking around. Oh, it's red! Yo, what's up? Hello, I... <laughs> This real slime who's doing research on monsters. So is this right after we left the, the museum? Conducting research on those monsters is a dangerous proposition. リツちゃんからもらった手がかりによれば怪物をこっそり研究してるのは診療所の医者のフィン。<laughs> たった一人の医者ができるようなことではありません。つまり、どういうこと <laughs> A few moments later, a, uh, a medicinal odor filled the air, and a slender young man appeared. <laughs> yeah, forget tailing him. Just run right in. Uh-oh. The moment Finn saw the irate Red, he broke off in a desperate sprint. Just as Red was about to catch him, the ominous pounding of footsteps could be heard from a distance. Hey, Red, I think there might be a I think there might be something way more important right now. <laughs> Just as the Honkai Beast was about to pounce on Finn, Red charged forward with as much speed as she could muster and tackled him out of the way. Let's go. Seeing Fuhua breaking through the encirclement of Honkai Beast and running up to the shield. Uh up up oh sorry, up to shield red. The panicked Finn hesitated for but a brief moment, then turned to flee, gritting his teeth. <laughs> oh, dude, dude. Oh, oh, now we actually just have them as a team. Oh, wait, wait, do we have special QTEs up in here? For realsies? For actuals? Hello? That is so sick. That is so sick. You're good, Red. <laughs> also, yeah, it's a special attack when you switch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, that's why. That's why I said it's different without being specific. And you asked about the combat. Okay, sick. <laughs> It's okay. You're just too. You're, you're a little too ambitious. It's fine. See, listen to Fuhua. She speaks the truth always and forever. I'm so pissed with myself right now. Red, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This place seems pretty, pretty small. At least from 
what we've seen. So, so, Kibako de Fusagareta Michiga Mada Arunda. Canary Mine in Noranego Tach no Tameni Tateta Yedakato, Imawa, Imasa Sakoeko. Sereto, Sukini Bukuga, Reses, Aosina Tatuki, a Zeta, Betsuni Murish de Kawako to Arimase. Omoiki de Atemite Kudasai. Dude, let's go. Oh my god, for what? There's no need to change who you are. If any bad guys show up, leave them to me. Alright, let's go, Red. Physical smash. Break special objects. Uh, obstacles that appear during exploration. When necessary, a gray tip will appear in conversations. Okay, great. Let's break it. Oh, whoops. I meant let's break it. Bonk. I love this outfit, too. I love any outfit on Fuwa. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. We be kicking, we be kicking. Hello. Twelve. Cut from twelve point three. No, no. Let's not split up. Yeah, see? So true. So true in base. I guess it doesn't matter, but I have them. I have down a muscle memory to switch so that you can match the weakness. Yeah, I never really even think about it. I just, I just go ham. I just go crazy. <laughs> uh, he could, could have left some traces behind. Is there anything about him that's distinct? That's, that's what filled the air when he first came by. No, just focus on the smell. Oh, Fuhua, are you going to focus on it? Observe, ah, uh, yes. My big brain ability. I can go big brain. Then we go left. Then we go left. Look at that cat. Oh my goodness, look at them. <gasps> Bird! Such a cute cat. The models really are so cute for the NPCs. Boop. I be looking, I be looking. Side story 1-1 one, one cleared. Can't pet the cat? I know. Criminal. <laughs> The sound of rustling came from behind the wall. Both Fuhua and Red began to tread softly and listen intently. <laughs> Red was chomping at the bit to go and bashed some heads in, but she stopped herself from leaping out at the last moment and then began to shake her head in frustration. <laughs> <laughs> because she said you don't need to change yourself. <laughs> you haven't done the side stories yet? When does this take place? Is this, is this right after we left the museum? Because I'm assuming I was supposed to do the side story since they just told me to do it. Like after that. Uh, you take the lead. That way you can ask if Finn has any, accomplice, uh, any accomplices and calm down and can be fired up. Alright, I'll go ahead. No, you should go ahead. Based. This is the based answer. Nah. You got it. You got it, <gasps> So cute. Oh my god. I'll be there to help you work through it just like the other Vitas. <laughs> One, two. Does each, does each side story have like three missions? <clears throat> Oh, 
Are you asking? Or, or to just ask and not wanting an answer? Well, that time... I mean, I wouldn't imagine that's a spoiler. If you think the answer's a spoiler, then don't tell me. How'd you catch up to me so quickly? Oh, uh, because we ran with our feet. Lumbering footsteps resounded from the side, and Finn's gaze shifted to the group of Honkai beasts that suddenly appeared. <laughs> Don't call him a dole. Before Fuwa had time to hold her back, Red had already rushed forward to shield Finn, paying no mind to the Honkai beast that could have trampled her in an instant. <laughs> because she cares about you. Hell yeah, baby. I'll kick their ass. Don't even worry about it. Bah! Oh my god, so sick. Bonk. I love the uppercut. I want to see the... Ooh. Ooh. The wings. God dang. Love it. So sick. So epic and awesome. Red -san, oh! <laughs> <laughs> the red feathers. No, you're good. You wanted to protect him, it's fine. And because you protected him, oh, because you protected him, he's actually going to talk to you. それにしてもこの大型物どうしてあんな危ない怪物を研究しようとするんだみんなごめん疑心実はこの病気にかかった患者たちを治せないことに悩んでたおおなおミステリアスイルネスこの病気にかかった患者たちを治せないことに悩ん
dragging away a fox? Oh yeah, true. There's the bridge I wanted. So true. <laughs> Well, let's follow. <laughs> no, no, the case is still very open. Shikashi, <laughs> You would have died, don't worry. <laughs> Let's go! Raise her confidence. Nah, don't, don't talk about ifs. See? Oh my god. Mutual trust is bog. Sometimes she最高の友人たちがいました。孤独の殻から救い、スレッドさんの兄弟も私の友人と同じように素敵な人たちです。だから勇気と親切が誰かに迷惑をかける顔を恐れないでください。I <笑> And then he immediately opened up to you. <laughs> building me up way too much. <laughs> no problem, Red. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible. Okay, so that's the end of the side mission. Interesting. I guess I'll see when it takes place. Oh! Oh, I can go back and, and actually choose... Ending not reached. Ah, so you can... Wait, that's so weird. You can actually, like... Get different endings. Uh, I'm going to assume they're not, like, so different that it's kind of, like, we're literally having routes now in terms of, like, story. Um, I can't start this one yet, can I? Unlocked after clearing the preceding story stage 48. Okay. Um, should I see what this is? Can I go through? I am me. Is it worth it, or should I do that on my own time? Because with the main story already being, like, seven hours long, I don't want to, like, go through all of it. If it's just, like, minuscule changes, you know what I mean? Definitely do it? Okay. Let's go back. Let's go back there, and we'll have us take the lead. All right, I'll go ahead. Let's do it. Let's see how this goes. Um. Okay, so the Honkai Bee still showed up. Don't just stand there. Fuhua held her back. Oh, but Finn? Oh? Oh? Fuhua stopped her from saving my boy? Dude, this, this animation is so sick. Oh 
Bonk. Bonk. Trying to slither off, uh, trying to slither off when we were distracted, eh? Good thing my partner here told me to keep an eye on you. Is there a reason this one isn't voiced? Uh, all I'm doing is looking into an unsolved mystery. What are you giving me such a hard time for? This is a completely new species, a magnificent discovery. You idiot, these are lethal monsters that can kill people. I'm putting the, uh, the kibosh on your research. What have you managed to discover so far? Why are you so interested all of a sudden? Uh, oh, now I get it. You want me to... That's right. Well, is it going smoothly? Well, not really. This here is the only specimen that I have access to, which is hardly of any value to my research. Anyway, can you two let me go now? Since when was curiosity a crime? Finn pulled out a specimen bottle from his pocket and handed it over to the shimmering, or to the simmering red, who was glaring at him with a searing intensity. Are you the only one conducting this research? Of course. This has all been a solo venture, hence why there's been next to no progress. I suppose that all matches up. All right, Finn, we've got your number, and you've—you'll uh, you'll have to explain everything to Green when we get back. Not the judge. Why would a uh, medical doctor who treats people suddenly want to study Honkai beasts? Could it uh, really be chalked up to mere curiosity? It seems a reasonable enough explanation, but everything went a bit too smoothly for my liking. I hope they can come up with something more convincing during questioning. What are you staring into space for? We should be celebrating. If it hadn't been for you, Finn would have given us the slip for sure. Not to mention that this was on a rare occasion for me to not be reckless. I'll have to tell Orange all about this when we get back. She'll be over the moon when she hears. You did a great job. If there's anything where you think I can be of help in the future, I'm willing and able. I appreciate that. For today, though, I can handle it. I've got a few other people I need to question. Thanks again for all the help. Glad to be of assistance. I'll try to remember not to be too reckless in the future. Well, I really should take Finn back and get started on all that paperwork. They thoroughly dejected Finn, followed behind the exuberant red, as the two of them passed by Fuhua. Finn seemed to sense an almost impersible gaze upon him. I think that's an imperceptible, not impersible. I just can't read. Interesting. Okay, so he didn't tell us about the letter in that one. Ending caution. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Now we continue. We'll try and see where that takes place, because I'm assuming this is actually going to pick up. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, she going crazy. Oh my god, she going crazy. Oh my god, she going crazy. Oh my hello. Uh oh. Fuka-san. <laughs> <laughs> I already killed him. <laughs> I already killed him, Fuwa. Don't even worry. <laughs> a big difference is Fuwa listened to Red and not wanting to be reckless, and the other one, Red says uh, that, uh, says that, but Fuhua said to be herself. I like the difference. Yeah, yeah, no, because that time Fuhua like actually, like physically stopped her from going in. Um, I think we're safe for now. Fuhua inspected this area to ensure it was no longer threatened by Honkai Beast and its residents had been evacuated by Eridite. Okay. So the museum is on the edge of the city. Oh. 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 I love this. Fuhua just being a loving mother to all the Vitas for real. <laughs> this is uh, this is crazy. This is a uh, uh, give Vita an actual loving mother arc. <laughs> so, so. 
Also, I really like how like sweet the Vitas are to each other. That's very nice. Yeah, it's because they're literally bugs to me. They are. She only says what she knows? <laughs> That's kind of interesting. She is the judge, so... Because we could start a, 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 an army, an army of Vitas. The artifact. Is the artifact the thing in the middle? Don't answer that. Oh, interesting. I wonder if there's a thing that they actually, like nuclear launch codes, they need to all use their keys at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized, because they all have a unique key. Oh, true. Yeah, the, the, we are slowly getting stronger Honkai Beasts. Erudite showed them his camera. Albeit blurred by moving lens, they could make out Archa uh, Archangel and Knight in the same picture. <laughs> Props to you. すごい発見だね。さすがだよ。と大したことじゃないよ。オレンジ姉さん。管理者にしては崩壊に対する彼らの知識は恐ろしいほど少ない。Well, they did say that they haven't really been attacked, so the Honkai thing is a new is a new situation. Uh, their understanding of Honkai is terribly little. With so many uncertainties at hand, Fuhua had to concentrate and analyze every fleeting possibility. Only this process was quickly interrupted. She felt a small hand on her back. Oh? One second. Sorry, Mushroom. Mushroom wants attention so badly right now. <laughs> um, encompassing Rose on her tiptoes, gently patting and comforting Fuhua. From her posture, it seemed like she originally intended to pat Fuhua on her head, but the height difference made her give up. <laughs> that is so cute. Orange What? That is so cute. <laughs> Literally just patted her on the back. Fuka-san <laughs> Just over at the square. Uh, I'm not an outsider anymore, Chad. Let's go. No, no, no. You did. You introduced her. Well, not in person. あの、<笑><笑> Incredible. Let's meet the other Vitas, chat. Seven that they said. 
There's gonna be a secret eighth Vita. Yellow, Ritz, Wako, Indigo. I like the way they said indigo. The bridge! Let's go! <laughs> Erudite, stop being so mean to yourself. Have some faith. Let's go! Okay, let's see. Do we know red? Do we know red? Okay, no, we do not. Okay. <laughs> ちゃんと来たでしょ <laughs> No, that makes sense. I mean, well, I mean, if it is an actual emergency, then I guess maybe you they should have. But that also makes sense that Green wanted everyone to be present. The mass children's disappearance? Forget the blackout. I'm more worried about the mass children disappearance. そうだけど、街に崩壊獣が現れたから崩壊獣何それ。オッケー、ハズアットランニングトワンディアット。つまり何かを壊しまくる怪獣で。あ、わかった。今まで見たことがなかった。ダークパープルアニマルズ。やっ
とはイエローとインディゴが来ればいいだけだねその件についてなんですが<笑> I do it purple I love I love purple purple is such a great color The Vita, who hadn't spoken yet, chimed in. A violet collared and innocent looking, she was dragged here by discipline. Oh. Oh, fun. Why? <laughs> Mushroom has convinced us. <laughs> oh my god, I said her name and she's going crazy.、Uh, sabotage as a Honkai doggo. <laughs> yes. Yeah, she do be a Honkai doggo. <laughs> Boku a set me sure. Machini Hewa ga modot dato. Boku a sugani kokoni kaketsketa. Seno keka. Kimera de sugo jiko a mamoru koto ga dekitanua. Kome. Orange. Orange kara ki de rukara. Sereva da hitoniwa. Taske ga hitio na toki ga arimas kara.私たちの中で一番みんなの願いを叶えてあげようとするビタン。とにかく。Right. 僕は見つけたバイオレットと一緒に残る町中を探しても二人の姿が見当たらなかったんだ。今も二人は集会に来ていない。中の調子が悪かったとか<笑>それとも迷子になったのかな What a red thing to say. We've barely known you, and that's, that's such a red thing to say. <laughs> Maybe they ate bad food or got lost. インディゴは私たちの中で一番聡明だし。ただ道に迷っただけなら見つからないはずがないイエローは嘘をつかない彼女が恋に僕たちを避ける理由があるとは思えないの The atmosphere suddenly grew heavy じゃあ僕たちはどうすればいいの立姉さんのルールだと7人のビタが揃ってないと I will say one, one thing that, I, that I, I'm not a fan of right now Is the fact that they're not sticking to just like calling them by the colors or their like normal name? Like they're, sw they're, they're swip swapping. <laughs> and maybe they're doing that just so that we'll actually like learn what their, their like titles and colors are quicker.、Uh, but it is slightly confusing. <laughs> I wish they would have just gone with the colors. <laughs> <laughs> やっぱり僕が間違ってたんだね。まずそれは僕のルールではなく。The、この町の人。正しくは、集まることができるビタが揃えば、集会を始められる。だよ。インディゴとイエローが集まることができない状況にいるなら、僕たちは一緒に集会を始めるきっと今、Mushroom, sit down. この町では僕たちを最も必要とするような、緊急事態が起きているんだと思う。ビタさんたちのリーダーである彼女は、情を知らないわけではない。Very adaptable. As if having、uh, heard Fuhua's inner assessment of her, Green suddenly shifted her gaze to her. She told him I was already. 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 Of course, anytime. It's, it's so fun beating up the Hawkeyes. There are openings. Yes. Let me be a Vita. She looked embarrassed when she said this. Hey, there it is. There is the, there is the shy thing again. <laughs> Bending the rules. We're bending the rules. Yeah, I'd love to. Orange. Yellow no maneva yamete hoshi. Yori say kakun yuto. Vita tachi no tokshu common. Temporarily as our special advisor. Sure. Yes, I agree. Mina no chikarani naritaito moti mas. You got. You don't wanna yonet. Mutira. Fukasan of Kange Syria. <laughs> so, 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 so
Okay. The the head nod. I think the only other person that has a head nod that's that like uh animated is it's Sele, right? Doesn't Sele have like a, he a little shy head nod? Oh, oh, that's new. That's a new one. <laughs> The Venus took their positions and exchanged what they and Fuhua knew. The appearance of the Honkai Beast and the disappearance of the two Venus. Yeah, so far, okay, they are growing in variety, but, but, they, we've only seen two. There's only been two so far. We only have regular weapons for policing purposes in store. And what type of weapons does that entail? <laughs> all, all seven little Vitas with, with, with pistols. <laughs> pistols and tasers. Uh, though using all those weapons at once wouldn't hurt. I don't think that would hurt the monsters. The Honkai Beast Crisis. I knew, I knew the problems. Look at that. We are truly here. In this meeting. Yeah, we can use Fuhua's little, little trace things. Give us some hints, and we will detective our way through it. Oh, what's up? What was your information again? Oh, 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 the fact that the animals reacted to it, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we could worry about the actual animals later. <laughs> What's up? I thought that I said the first time to use the artifact. Okay, yes. Can you explain what this artifact is? Because everyone seems to be not wanting to touch it. Uh, hearing this, the other four Vitas fell silent simultaneously. From their shocked look and abrupt glance exchanges, Fu Hua could tell it meant much more than that. Yeah, what is the artifact? <laughs> Ab absolutely not. Hello, brother. How are you enjoying the chapter so far? I'm loving it so far. <laughs> Welcome at Dark Light. I love the, the little, like, all the different mannerisms that the Vitas have. <laughs> They're so adorable. But the artifact can? Yeah, I don't even think it's a weapon. I don't think it's a weapon. I'm assuming it's the clock. Can we reverse time in this bitch? Naturally, divine keys were the first thing that sprang to Fuhua's mind. They were artificial creations of many uses and forms. They provided humanity with the means of combating Honkai, and were associated with concepts such as religion and archaeology in the common eyes. For an instant, her mind roamed farther. If there was a uh, precursor civilization that predated the Vedas. Or there was someone with superpower who could create things out of thin air, much like the Hersha of Sentience or the Hersha of Reason. But her speculations were not either affirmed or denied. Yeah, see, it's not even a weapon. Oh! <laughs> okay, so if we did use the artifact, it would be your guys' first time. Ah, so is there rules in the spell universe like the other one? The artifact is one of the authorities that city representatives can activate. One of the authorities. 
僕たちの緊急対応には三つのランクがある。Okay. Gumahua found another seven kids to take care of. Yeah, that's what I mentioned earlier. It's, lit it's literally just her being a loving and caring mom. <laughs> okay. The assembling of the And have you never gone to level three before? Interesting. Oh, oh, oh my god, I was, I was actually right. They probably do have to all use the. But, okay, so now are they going to realize you can't actually. Okay, maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm wrong. You need the unanimous consent of the seven Vitas. We can activate the artifact in this square. So weird. Okay, yeah, so they've never had to use it before. We could try and find them first before we use the artifact. Yeah, see? Oh my god, I am disappointed. <laughs> Take, yeah, proactive measures. <laughs> Maybe the real artifact is the friends we made along the way. <laughs> I don't know. All the Vitas. Silence. The turbulent situation that disappeared companions. This was perhaps the deepest concern of the Vitas, and why Red was anxious to activate the artifact. But this pointed out the heart of the matter. <sighs> and you have no idea what will actually happen when you activate it. Ah, was I right? You need the keys. Yeah, 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 you keep saying authority. Noticing the doubt in Fuhua's eyes, Cyan tugged at the uh, at her him discreetly. Yes, I do. I do. What orange used? When we went into the museum, what did orange use? Didn't I open that though? Oh, no, no, no. I opened up the gate to the secret door. That was the loudest water bottle in the world. Her eyes fell on Cyan's chest, or the key like object that was hanging there, to be exact. Yes, I've noticed the keys that you guys all have. どのビタも同じ鍵を持ってるんだ。これを使えば街のあらゆる入り口を自由に開放できる。Oh <笑> Even though I'm glad that I was able to call it out. <laughs> she looked at Fuhua. Orange is um, also, furthermore, if you do need all seven keys, that's kind of unfortunate. Because if the situation became irredeemable, right, all seven of the Vitas would have to be safe. <clears throat> but if they lost, well, I guess they could just tap the key. Not saying one of them would die, but if one of them did end up, you know, being lost in some one way or another, as long as they could find the key, and that's all they would need. Just lockpick it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just lockpick in authority. 
Or dig into the earth. Okay, I'll fight. You dig into the earth and find yellow and blue. Well, the cause of the upheaval. Honkai. The Honkai beasts. ホーカイ獣は暴走した崩壊エネルギーによって生まれる存在です。そして、ここのホーカイ獣は断続的に群れとなって現れています。私の経験談ですが、私たちがまだ把握できていない崩壊エネルギーに支配されているような存在するはず
Holy shit. This art is incredible. Dude, new backdrops. Crazy. あ、すみません。少しぼーっとしていました。今年売りたちを連れて遠足するってバイオレットさんが言ってましたから、この一帯は私が旅で出かけた場所のように感じたと思っていたのです。そっか。あのね、バイオレットは相談しやすいことなん
この日々は遠回りする必要があるようです先ほどは群れから離れた崩壊銃を倒しただけですから巣窟まではもう少し距離があると思いますフカさんこの日々の向こうにある建物が見えるかな、okay. あそこが金属地だよ、so、the building is the actual forbidden ground. 結構近いよね日々に沿ってもう少し歩いて橋を越えたらすぐに入り口があるからレッドはきっとその近くにいるはずだよ私たちも行こう Sure, let's do it. Let's hurry. Let's go. Let's get on with it. <laughs> I love their walking animation so much. Come on, Fuha. Let's cross the fissure. Let's go. We just gotta jump. You have a jump button, right? What's up, girly? What you thinking? Tokoro de. この大きな日々ですが、ここで地震が発生したことがあるのでね。確か大地がガタガタ揺れて、建物が全部崩れていくっていう感じだよね。あ、そんな風に話してもすぐにはわからないかな。少し休もう。No no no。What? What are you talking about? Would you like to take a break? I'm fine. Well, okay, well, okay. Can you give me the cliff notes? <laughs> We need to make sure that red is not in danger. Please write down these two names. Yes. Demo, what is the chiva? Saisokara Kokoni Tawakeshanaino. People live. People lived in a different place. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So the previous civilization lived here. Arhi, Osero Si Ten Saigaokite. What is the chino yo koas chatano? Okay, so that must be what the, the museum stuff is. It was about, it was about this previous civilization. Okay. Her answer was somehow ambiguous. Was the artifact not created at the time? そうだよねねえバコ私たちは生物を使ったと思う、oh? 本当は使ったことがあるけど、oh? Now that brings a whole new, a whole new interesting idea. So they don't, because they didn't say it would be our first time using it before, but they don't even know if they have. それはないと思う。But if it does erase your memories, then you wouldn't remember anyway. 僕も当時のことをよく覚えてないんだはるか昔のことだからと,とにかく生物みたいな最終手段に頼らなくても Also, that means, or at least from what they're saying, they were there in the previous civilization レッドが焦ったのもイエローとインディゴがよく、うん、でも二人は無事だって信じてるよインディゴは私たちの中で一番聡明なビタだし Missing. So, yeah, Hokanomi Nani t o t e m Yes, they do. They do think that. <laughs> Fuwa hadn't had time to sort out her situation since coming to the city. She raised her head and observed this forbidden ground, this mysterious huge structure. More questions sprouted in her heart. A retro yet advanced city state, and、uh, an unexplained Honkai catastrophe, a strange museum, and a group of peculiar administrators. オレンジさんと和子くんの説明を聞く限り、経命と兆候の歴史は、私の知っているすべての歴史とはかなり違う。だから、ここは多分。Oh boy, I love choices. So this place should be、um, a bubble universe in the sea of Quanta, a crafted dream, or a remote and untouched paradise.、Um, it's a bubble universe. For sure. The billions of bubble universes in the Sea of Quanta could, in theory, accommodate any fantastical world, but 
Fua took out that article. Uh, took out the article hidden under her top again. She had seen the reading on it uh, when it was discovered by the Vidas. The reading hadn't changed at all. The portable terminal could display the dimensional basis of the proper world, but it couldn't establish communication with anyone. The strange state could only mean one thing. Fuhua's missing uh, was outside the Cosmic Juggernaut's coverage, but not yet inside the Sea of Quanta. Okay. <clears throat> a remote and untouched paradise. A crafted dream? <laughs> a paradise without... <laughs> oh my god, this is incredible. I love this. Uh, a paradise without Honkai. Unchanging terminal reading. This was possible in a dream. But obviously, if the Hersher of Sentience was the mastermind behind all this, Fuhua would be surrounded by screeching creatures and busy dealing with a carpet of feathers. <laughs> the problem was, if this wasn't a dream, how could she explain the previous suspicions? A remote and untouched paradise. On a planet that had entered the space age, uh, could a civilized region that was independent of the globalized society exist? <laughs> On the proper Earth. She did also say that it probably isn't. It's none of them. Couldn't think of any other possibilities. Encompassing and erudite. Oh, I like the dude, the colors when you can see them next to each other. The next thing Fuhua knew was the two Vidas watching uh watching her together with attentive eyes. <laughs> do you have guesses? Um, I do have some. Well, uh, well, my original guess was that it was just a bubble universe in the Sea of Quanta, but. So it's. Hmm. It's outside of Cosmic Juggernaut's range, but it's not yet in the Sea of Quanta. Hmm. Uh. Nantonakudakido. Sugok. No yander mitai da takara. No, actually, I don't have any guesses right now. I'm quite confused. Sano. What does the chica cookie on the Hanasio stetakara? Fukasem mo kairi ta hit the mutano. Hazimete at the tokikara. <laughs> I'm sure you do train every day. <laughs> it's a tricky one for sure, I know. I was very confident that it was just a bubble universe, but... Because I thought that's what they said. That they knew, they saw... Well, no, because they, they need Sinti, right? They said that they, they knew that they would need Sinti. So are we in... Hmm. The way that they they did the little opening sequence looked like how they 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 showed uh, Prometheus opening up like the power of the will of the Honkai. So what I'm going to say is that we are in a weird consciousness world of Saw. Don't ask me to explain further yet. どうやってここに来たのかについて考えていたのです。いくつかの可能性を考えましたが、自分で一つずつ否定してしまい、疑問についてはしばらく置いておいて、置いておくの。順番があるのです。約束したからには。Your commission first. それにまだここのことをよく知りません。そんな時は。let me solve your commission first. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All the little Vitas helping us find everyone. That'd be so cute. 
Uh oh. Oh, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting a little like actual cinematic here. I say cinematic. Oh, they were just doing a cool little, cool little uh, camera shot, huh? Rocks. Oh, is this like POV Fuhua? <laughs> oh, what to know where she's going? Oh, <laughs> wait, that's so cute. What? When she can't solve it by counting on her fingers, she just uses rocks. Uh oh, there's so many blobs. Oh, don't worry. Easy, easy. Um, I just realized, do I have shared SP between all the different units, or... Oh my god, kicking ass. Kicking ass. What does she do when she runs out of rocks? She grows more fingers. And then when she runs out of the fingers, then she spawns more rocks out of thin air. After defeating a small wave of Honkai Beasts, the three were near their destination. <laughs> <laughs> Yippee! Yippee!。Let me see it. What's the bridge? <laughs> Why did you just destroy the opening to the bridge? Girly, this is a spaceship. This is a spaceship. What are you talking about? The out-of-place construct in her, uh, in front of her was glaringly different from her understanding of bridges. Then again, from what she had seen and heard in Chiming and... Uh, that is how you say that one, right? Chiming... I don't know how to pronounce that one. Most things were disharmonious to a degree. Um, if it was only the out... Uh, do, why can I not read today? Uh, brain fried. I need more food. If it was only the accumulation of this sense of disharmony crossing the threshold, Fuhua wouldn't have been so surprised. However, unlike those that came before it, the bridge gave Fuhua a vague premonition. Despite still not knowing where she was, she was beginning to suspect that she came here for a purpose. Let's go. <clears throat> At the same time, in Phosphorus. Oh, good. <gasps> Do I get to play as Vita? I get to play as Purple? Purple? <gasps> old man. Hold out, old, old man. <gasps> yes, I'm playing as Purple! <laughs> Let's go! Don't worry, I will not get spotted. Don't spot me. Let's go. Run, run, run. Hello, Ian. Oh, oh, this is good. Oh, this is so sad. No, 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 you're good. <laughs> oh, do I have to? Do I have to actually escort them? Oh, okay, no. Just kidding. You're already saved. What do you mean I saved two of them? I've only saved one of them. Ian counts as two people. Oh, can I not go down from here? Oh, I can. I did. I, I didn't think I was gonna actually drop down. My bad. My bad. <laughs> it didn't look like I could. I call a recount. This is my first try. This is still my first try. I didn't mess up yet. Hello, Lana. You're not gonna die. Don't worry. You're fine. You're fine. Yeah, see, exactly. <laughs> I'm here to save you. Oh my god, I am literally purple. You couldn't find flower. Let me go. Let me go. Oh, old man. Hello. Peter! 
ピーターさん、大丈夫ですかバイオレット。It is. バイオレットか。落ち着いて、手をこちらに。すぐに連れ出しますからね。お待ちを。Oh, you've got the meds? Oh my god, purple is goaded. やっと呼吸が楽になったさ。ありがとう、バイオレット。Oh, yeah, 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 when she h e l p e d his dog. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Is that the dog's name then? Dude, the fact that she just had the meds is incredible. Let's go. 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 <laughs> Even purple doesn't know. Oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> It's okay. Uh, uh, one of you fight. Oh, let's go. Are we actually going to see them deal with Honkai Beast? Oh, the dive. Let's go. Barely made it. <laughs> As the dust settled in the physical、uh, sense, the Honkai beasts that tried to invade Jiming were blocked out of the safety zone by the Vitas. <laughs> Wait, so who dropped the boxes? Dang, okay. One's carelessness equals everyone's carelessness. Choose telekinesis. The Hopper family, okay. Oh, did you just collapse the house? Did you just collapse the old house? Get out of my way. Ah, smart bricks. What are the difference between bricks and smart bricks? <laughs> Every brick individually connects to your Wi-Fi. Oh, let's go. Oh, blue's the smartest one of them, so. Green took out the terminal used by city representatives and showed Violet the information on its screen. Phosphorus,、uh, warehouse access log, 40 minutes ago, accessed by Mindful Vita.、Um, 40 minutes ago, accessed by Voracious Vita. Now some demolition is done. Well, we don't know if they're fine just yet, actually. I wouldn't say that.、Uh, Green's frown only tightened as she watched、uh, Violet rejoice. The message left by her two missing colleagues did、uh, assuage her fear. However, as the leader of the Venus, she had a lot more to worry about. Yeah, what's up with that? What are they doing? I mean, yeah, I'm sure they can take care of themselves, but something suspicious is definitely afoot. <laughs> good intuition. Purple's got good intuition. Ah. That was weird. How they did that? Okay. And you can also find yellow if you find blue. 
彼女が自分の意思で町の中に残っているならバイオレットシステムにあるすべての訪問記録僕と一緒によかった Secret messages in the logs? Dude, green might, might be mega smart as well. The examination only lasted 10 minutes or so. They finally found their answer. There was a secret in the log. Oh, in the museum? When we were there? Question mark? Oh, hello. Ooh, look at that backdrop for the museum. They had hoped to find their colleagues in the museum, but they weren't so lucky. Which was expected. Had Yellow not left a record for unlocking the museum gate, honestly, they wouldn't have thought of it. Um, and that record could only prove the two colleagues they were looking for had been here, not still here. <laughs> Did you spot something? What? What's up? Violet was uh, wholly focused on wiping the glass display with her handkerchief. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> she just wants to make it look spotless. Aww. Don't call yourself dumb. Miss Vida! Ah, this, I, the secret 8th Vita. The non color Vita. Her friendly face came to their minds at the mention of one of the owners of this museum. It's her favorite place. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Is it evil Vita or not evil Vita? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I don't... <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, first of all, this art is really cute. Here to arrest me? Why would you arrest her? I love her design so much. Both. Was this the one that, that was written with the initial V? With majestic black mountains, vast white plains, and villages and markets dotting the land like stars in the sky. Okay. Uh, <laughs> no, surely that's not it. <laughs> <laughs> For a moment, Vita's expression changed, uh, changed subtly. Um, or rather, it was hard to tell if her expression actually changed at all. No, it definitely changed. It was the first thing I noticed. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> she brings them souvenirs. <laughs> I Great, thanks. Riley felt like it just happened yesterday. Miss Vita returned to Phosphorus every so often. So why did that time leave such a deep impression on her? 
She didn't delve into this. Even if she noticed Miss Vita's unusual expression, she didn't know its hidden meaning. Not to mention her walk down memory lane was promptly interrupted by her colleague. Oh, because, okay, so she, can she actually read minds? She calls them family house sweet. Because this is the second time, because she looked at, at Fuhua when she thought about, about uh, her, about Green. It's too lazy to catch up with all the new story in Honkai back there, so I just watch people playing it just in case I want to play part two. That's honestly so based. And hey, I'm catching up so that I can play part two. Well, okay, again, I don't think you need to catch up to play part two, but I want to do it anyway, just so that I'm I know. <laughs> Violet squinted and peered into the depths of the museum. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Not the body. Moriarty, no. Oh no. Who are you? あの話を盗み聞きする趣味はないし、わざと声を出して二人のレディを驚かすつもりもなかったんだ。あは。これはタイミングの悪さによって生まれたもう解散。こんなことになった以上、知らぬふりをするのは伊佐坂失礼かと
Okay, the fissure under the bridge is dimensionally misaligned with the proper world. Okay. Okay. So are we looking at another kind of like upside down situation with Salt City? The scale's too large. Her brief thinking led to the only conclusion. Nothing could be concluded from the scarce evidence. Uh, and so she turned to the locals for help. <laughs> She's just sitting there in silence for so long and they didn't say anything. They were just letting Fuwa think. They're like, hey, let, let, her, let her be a detective for a second. If she falls you a fishing rod, let's go. I doubt that they have. うん。僕たちが知っているのはこの well, it, does, it seems like they don't come here that often, so. She thought she'd understand this world better after approaching the Forbidden Grounds, but the reality was the opposite. She kept receiving information that was either ambiguous or contradictory, and so her doubts grew. Right, so you're not in the proper world. Are indirectly connected at most. Okay. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, so I'm saying, why do they have weird, at, like, big technology? She unconsciously looked down at the fissure beneath again. Uh huh. Okay, help me, Fuwa. Help this poor little brain. Did you figure it out? Earth-shaking. <laughs> Fantastic. Love that. <laughs> no photos left either. Oh, so you do just be knowing. That catastrophe was likely caused by the collision and splitting of tectonic plates as the ground changed shape. In a short time, the surface buildings were all destroyed. It was very much like an earthquake up to this point. But after destroying the buildings, the earth continued to crack. Without the earth to support them, the water bodies became rampaging floods. In the end, the fissure appeared and swallowed up the floods, effectively saving the people. The fissure appeared and swallowed up the floods. <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> bro said didn't have any memory and then it said everything. Like reading a textbook or just casual remark echoed in Fuhua's mind. <laughs> See, they're like, how is she so smart? <laughs> What's up? What did you guys come up with? What are you thinking? Yes? It's a little orange candy. Are you going to offer me the orange candy? <laughs> Thank you. 
Man, she just be she do just be listening to them, huh? Aww. Oh, wait, this is so cute. This is so cute. <laughs> what? Uh, following Orange, the three sat in a row at the corner of the bridge and began to have some candy. Look how, look how she looks so happy. Was it an energy bar? <laughs> an energy game? It wasn't flattery. The refreshing sweetness brought Fruhua back to the days when she traveled with Book of Fushi. Um, the taste of sugar had not seemed to change, whether it was a short time ago or a long time ago. Therefore, it was always comforting. <laughs> because why would you not have candy with you, obviously? Did you see her put it in her pocket? Oh, oh. Your passion for candy. Do you not... Did you not want them to know that you had a passion for candy? <laughs> oh, ah. Hello? Why did it just grab my OBS? Okay. <laughs> just grabbed my OBS and pulled it into my monitor. No, the candy bag would flatten. Everything happens to these Vitas and win a riot. This is Honkai. <laughs> Of course something's gonna happen to these Vitas, are you kidding me? This entire time they've been setting them up, having these adorable ass animations, all these cute arts. Of course something is gonna happen to these Vitas. <laughs> yeah, both of you reveal your secrets immediately. I know, Mushroom. You need to go out for some reason again. Give me one second. We're almost done. We're almost done with Act 2. Cyan stole a glance at Fuhua and sighed to himself. He clenched his fist and seemed to have finally made up his mind. Uh-huh. Okay, so you were suspicious of us for... When we first met you, we were all very cautious deep down. After all, something we city representatives should be cautious about happened back then. Mm, what, like, a, what, an outsider? Just an outsider? Hello, Vanity. Been lurking for a long while now. It's getting late over here, so I'll be hitting the hay. Although I do not play Honkai Back 3, I appreciate the birth, uh, the B-Day stream. Uh, your streams are so positive, and your laughter is very captivating. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I'll be watching your Honkai Star or Pinnacody later. Thank you, and good night. Hey, thank you for lurking. I appreciate it. Thank you for the kind words. And you will absolutely enjoy the Pinnacody stream. <laughs> I, I promise you. I promise you. Thank you for being here. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <clears throat> You like how they uh, they know to be skeptic, the Vitas, I mean? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're like, when they were, actually, when I said that they were like an actual, like, council, <laughs> they all have their own actual independent, like, personalities. And they're very cute. Very adorable. Mm. And they're not dumb. Like, they do be no one. I am a detective. <laughs> Orange beamed encouragingly at him. That is, yes, 
Yeah, that is true. Because we had, we, we technically, I mean, yes, we're trying to investigate so that we can leave. But it was more out of a, she just wanted to help them. At the mention of that phrase, a, f a far away look appeared in her eyes. You're like purple. Yes, I <laughs> me when I be known. Me when I be known. <笑>みーはないびのんみーはないびのんかのじょたちよりずっとすごいけどねふかさんだけだきっとふかさんだけが最後まで調査に付き合ってあおキーメイが直接ってるのかそれにふかさんがそういう人だからこそ uh, yes, of course I will. Oh. oh, let's go! That's so cute! Yes, of course you could be my little detective assistants. Of course! My little miniature detectives. All those immature words formed a declaration that the speaker had poured all his courage into. A detective and her assistants. For a brief moment, Fuhua's mind traveled to a distant past. Back when she had put on this outfit for the first time. Her companion back then had written a saying for their journey afterward. The seeker of truth will be back a thousand times over. Perhaps this adorable city representative before her and his ex uh, expectations for this acquaintance as well as himself, would also be the same. This outfit is so good. Seriously. I know, I know. Hold on, Mushroom. Hold on. We're almost done with this act. And then I can let you out. Mushrooms go crazy. はい。<laughs> Another piece of candy. Yeah, <laughs> too much candy. Oh, dude. Okay, holy shit. The amount of, like, incredible art that we're getting in the backgrounds is so sick. Between their playful pushes and banter, the candy wrapper in Orger's hand fell out of her grasp and flew toward the other side of the breach. Before she could even stand up, Fuhua stepped forward and got the emergency under control with the tip of her shoe. However, before bending down to pick up the mischievous candy wrapper, she would never have imagined what kind of evidence she would get from it. Hello? What's on the wall, girly? Oh, shit! <laughs> what? I mean, I mean, I know. I know, I know who it is. Again, I know who it is. But damn. <laughs> the thoughts that must be going through Fuhua's mind right now. <laughs> Man, I really wish I had played this when it came out and I didn't know who it actually was. That would have been so sick. I would have been like, oh my god, what? <laughs> Okay, so now I can do the other side story, right? Okay, yes, I can. And this is locked up to 412. After 412. Okay, and that's after what? 40... Oh, this is also after 412? Oh, do all of these unlock after... Oh, no, no, no. Okay, that's 416. Okay, sick. Hell yeah. Okay. Um, A new side story's been unlocked. Yes, that's crazy. I, I just saw that, actually. Thank you. Okay, so I can use these to upgrade them, right? Hawk of the Fog. This is my favorite unit of Fuhua that exists ever. Level up. What am I even leveling up? I don't. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Okay, sick. Increases lightning damage. Oh, I can only choose one? Total damage? Yeah, let's do total damage. Bonk! Oh, wait, can I do all of them? These are all different, no? Oh no no no, they aren't different. I thought they I thought they were different colors. Yeah yeah, I'll do I'll do the side stories first. Uh, can I level you up again? Yatta. Okay. Uh, unlocks at battle suit level thirty. Holy shit! 
Okay, it's every time I level them up, I can choose one of these. Okay. Oh, okay. Is this just like a... Oh, wait. What the shit? Whoa. Okay, let me not look at that, because I don't think I know what that is right now. Okay, let's just get all of these, and then we'll redo total damage again. And then before I spend everything... <coughs> Whoa! Uh, upgrading Hawk of the Fog. Let me actually um, upgrade the other ones, too. Boop. 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 One more. Um... Ooh, 10 bonus SP. Hell yeah. No, I don't want to exit the game, bro. Okay, Phoenix. Do, do, do. No. Okay, whatever. Total damage. Let's just do fire damage for Phoenix. Stop it. Okay. Sick. Detective's notes. Oh, hell yeah. Love that. Oh, crystals. Let's go. Wait, do I have enough to pull? No, I don't. This is so sad. How far away is my pity? I so badly... Oh, wait. Did the Fuha... I love this Mobius skin so much. Shit. Fuha's gone? I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I actually missed. I missed out. Oh my god. I couldn't spend money, chat. I couldn't spend money. Oh. They better rerun her. Like, tomorrow. <laughs> okay. I'll be right back. I need to let Mushroom out because she clearly needs to go outside. Look, see, I said her name and she came running. Alright. Um, this one might be a little bit longer because I think she needs to go number two um so we'll do the normal break time letting mushroom outside and then we will continue brb in about 12 to 15 minutes it'll probably be about 12 minutes but just in case it's a little bit longer there's that so once again chat if you need to um if you need to go get a drink go to the bathroom do whatever now is the time i am also going to let my headphones charge for a little bit just in case they're getting a little low on the battery let me change my audio source and i will get some music playing for you ta-da oh i need to actually change the source on this okay there we go. Now you have music. Okay. Be right back.
I'm back. I return. Okay. So, I have a question. I have a question. Is it just me? Or, what time is it? Are we making really good time? Are we making really good time? <clears throat> Because I thought this was going to take us like seven hours to complete, but we only have act three left and each, each act has only taken like, what, really like an hour and a half, maybe two hours. <clears throat> so unless either the side missions are really long or act three is significantly longer than the other ones, I feel like we're making really good time. <clears throat> okay. You should be able to hear the game. Da, 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 da. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it, chat. Dude, it's cold as hell outside right now. I mean, I know it's like getting... I mean, I know it's late, but there's a cold front that's coming in. Tomorrow, the, it's, it's, it's randomly, randomly, tomorrow, uh, there's a high... It's a high of 42 or 45 or something like that. Something crazy. Okay, so this is a, uh, this is a side story with... What is that? I'm colorblind. Uh, orange? Orange, orange, orange. Uh, what? The children in the city are plotting a prank? That won't do. Welcome to the peaceful Chiming. But is it truly what it seems? Harmony home. Welcome to the peaceful Chiming. Let's get in there. Let's get in there. I'd say you're going very good time? Hell yeah. Let's go. That never happens. Fuwa was serenely taking in the coming and going of passerby when she suddenly heard a voice calling her. Hello. What's up? Oh, it's pretty epic. I really like the architecture. The, 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 <laughs> I really like the architecture. What <laughs> So basically, well, it would be a fantastic tourist destination. <gasps> Let's go! You're gonna be my guide? Orange stood tall and proud, looking just like a miniature adult. Fuwa couldn't help but smile and nod. Fuwa and just be vibing. Fuwa we'll just be just be going along with everything. <laughs> the capable and precocious guide took Fuwa's hand and introduced her to the city that was so near and dear to her. Let's go. <laughs> I love how I'm barely rocking and 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 Orange is like actually jogging. <laughs> With reds, good maintenance. Very interesting. Wouldn't expect red to have good maintenance. <laughs> I like how the cat's still there. Okay, I have a desire for this NPC to be turned into more than just an NPC. <laughs> Why is she such a cutie? Why is she such a cutie for real? Let's go on. Oh, also, while we were gone, chat, I got a new cup of coffee. Exciting. Can't wait to see what it tastes like. Oh, uh, of course, Orpal. Of course, Purple takes care of the plants. Come on now. You love the name encompassing, it fits her speech and how um and how she is. Encompasses everyone, I mean. Yeah, it is very cute. All the names are very cute. Are these some of the kids that went missing in the mass children disappearance? Saving progress. After stumbling upon a group of squabbling children, Orange intervened with a stern look on her face. Yeah, true, true overseers. 
Oh, okay, bye. See you later, girl. I'm gonna just run off on my own. Wait, can I talk to anybody? Hello, hello. Oh, wow. It's just not blocking me off in the entire thing, huh? Well, I'm definitely touring. Tour Phosphorus alone. Oh, did the music? Oh, oh, they hit in that note. Let's go. <gasps> fire. Can I light? Can I unlight the fire? Oh, hello. What's up, bro? Oh, no. I think because I upgraded Fuwa so much, <laughs> I am now going to be doing a lot more damage. Wait, but I don't think I've been here yet. Oh, wait. Okay, I won't explore it. We'll probably see it later in the story. I won't explore it yet. <laughs> you gonna do laps? Of course. Come on now. Come on now. Investigate. Oh, the big lollipop? Excuse me. And got found by Orange? Did they kidnap Orange? I am. I do be the guest. You better not be lying to me. You better not be lying to me. Little girl nodded nervously. Girly. Don't be lying to me. Bop, bop, bop. Oh my god. Yes, we are doing a lot more damage. Oh my goodness. I need to find orange. Find orange. Detective. A slip? Bonk. Mysterious underground gut check meet. <laughs> what? Oh, the museum? Well, okay. Off we go. Back to the original. Oh, hello. What's up? This is where the decision comes in, right? After the... Following the clues they had gathered, Fuwa finally spotted a frantic figure not far ahead. What happened? Uh, can you tell me what happened? <laughs> oh, see, look. The first thing she asked. Are you hurt? Are you okay? A bit too mischievous. Would you put them in timeout? Oh. oh, so you just let them go on the adventure, huh? <laughs> the one and only warrior. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. I infiltrated their ranks in an attempt to flush out the ringleader, but they got wise to me. <laughs> no. Do you not like to go in the basement alone? Oh, oh, you can't, you, you don't remember? Oh, wait, the, what the frick? The lights aren't here. Orange pointed at the metal cover on the ground looking frustrated. <laughs> Fuwa took out the flyer she had found earlier. Looking past the attention-grabbing headline, the flyer featured a crudely drawn map of the city. Several locations in the res uh, residential area, as well as the entrance to the museum, were clearly marked. <laughs> Uh, it's pretty normal for kids to want to know what's in an area that's forbidden to go. <laughs> that's pretty normal. No, 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 let me help. Oh. <laughs> Encompassing Vita opened the entrance to the museum. Please don't tell me they trashed the museum. 
この紙の塊が落ちていたのですが勇気を出して挑戦しよう Courage challenge plan Or sorry, courage challenge again 博物館を見つけたのかな焦らないでくださいここに他の手がかりがないか探してみます Oh, oh my god. I was like, why does it keep every single time that she said check? It's been in, in yellow text. I was like, why? It's because they want the player to realize that they need to use this. I, I just automatically assumed we were supposed to do that. Or maybe it was my subconscious because the text was green or yellow that I knew that they needed to do it. The lollipop. <laughs> Did I give it to the other Oh, yeah, she shares the candies. Yeah, they just, they just be doing circles, no problem. Hmm? What's up, girly? At least tell me what you remember. Don't just run off. Oh, investigate door. What, the camera? <laughs> but maybe it got the... She had a, a ring doorbell on the... <laughs> Let's check it. Once the mechanism was activated, they started to examine the history records one by one. Oh, it was? It was her? Orange? Why your, me why your memory not there? Uh -huh. When Purple came to clean the museum last time, everything was immaculate, so I thought of leaving her something to clean, and it totally slipped my mind. What, so Purple likes cleaning, so you intentionally left some stuff for her to clean? <laughs> Wait. Okay, that is really cute, but <laughs> also unfortunate <laughs> that she has to trash the place. Oh, but that is really cute. Very incredible. <laughs> Suburban ruins. Uh oh. Ooh, excuse me. Are you talking about? Hey, hey, hey. Fuba, what are you talking about? Is a verbal dressing down enough? Are you talking about <laughs> spanking him? Hold on. Fuwa, don't spank the kids. ま、違いを正して、ちゃんとした価値観を持てるように導いてあげること。そう話しているときのオレンジさんは確かに保護者らしいですね。あ、深さんは忘れていないよね。Just <笑> I love the two different choices. Me saying, of course I'm going. And then Fuhua being like, I mean, I, I was going to, but is that okay? <laughs> Blue's automated patrol bots? What? Let me see what they look like. <laughs> bypass the security bots, take out the security bots. Okay, well, don't take them out. Let's just bypass them. 
stage, side story, 2-4. Two 2-4. Four. Two four. These footprints definitely belong to a child. Fuwa and Encompassing Vita follow the intermittent footprints all the way to... Uh, okay, how do you say this, Chad? Is it Chengjing? I feel like that's not correct, but maybe it is. Chengjing. Where the security bots were uh, making their rounds with pinpoint precision. Um, quite a dedicated security system you've got here. The children will have a hard time trying to stir trouble here. Okay, so I'm assuming the one that's voiced is the correct route. So we must have chosen the wrong route, which is odd. Um, that's strange. Why are there so many of them? The number of bots here on active patrol is way more than the amount I activated. Another prank from the children, perhaps? These kids are really getting out of line. I'll notify Green to keep a closer eye on the children in uh, Chiming and have a proper talk with them. Orange seems genuinely angry, a sight that I've never seen before. <laughs> yeah, look at her. <laughs> That's a red expression right there. Fuwa touched the two candies in her pocket. Um, touched the two candies in her pocket, which Orange gave to her. According to everyone, Orange is a candy lover. Yes. Want a candy? <laughs> huh? Don't worry, the kids will be fine. I know you want to get, uh, want to find them sooner rather than later, but first you've got to calm down. You're right. Thanks. <laughs> Encompassing Vita peeled open a candy and put it in her mouth, then peeled open another one and held it to Fuhua's mouth. <laughs> you have one too, Miss Fuhua. You went through so much with me. You deserve it. <laughs> uh, Fuhua paused for a moment. She had intended to console Orange, but had hardly expected to receive the same treatment in return. It seems Orange's natural tendency is to take care of others. She never places herself first. No matter what the situation is, in that aspect, she's quite similar to the book of Fushi. Alright, we'll resume our search after a little candy break. <laughs> the gentle sweetness slowly spreads across her taste buds. Feeling more at ease, Orange suddenly remembered something. Oh, I just remembered. To prevent the security bots from malfunctioning, Blue designed a kill switch for emergencies. It's over there. Encompassing Vita pointed to another path that was even more obstructed. If we get to that kill switch, we won't have to worry about the security pods. But I don't want to waste time. I want to make a beeline for the kids. Oh, I can't decide. I'll leave it to you, Ms. Fuhua. Should we avoid the patrolling security bots while following the footprints? Or should we take a detour to get to the kill switch? Mm. Avoid the security mechas and find the children. Optional. Obtain the main switch for the security mecha. Uh, footprints go... That way? Is this the kill switch? I want to do the optional one. I feel like the optional one would have to be the one where the waypoint isn't going, right? Yeah, it has to be. The main switch is just over there. Okay, let's do this. Look how easy this is going to be. Watch. Oh my god, I'm goaded. Ho 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 ho! Uh, burn combustible obstacles that appear during exploration. It can also blow fuses and destroy circuits in some places. When necessary, a red tip will appear. Okay, let me do it. Let me do it. BAM! Oh, did it not? Did it not work? Or did it work? With Orange leading the way, they managed to locate the kill switch. Nicely done, Miss Fuhua. Now we can check the system records without looking over our shoulder. Fuhua tried throwing the kill switch. Nothing happened. Huh? What's going on? Could it have been tampered with as well? Are uh, little kids even capable of something like this? Sorry, Miss Fuhua. Looks like I led you on another wild goose chase. It's okay. Let's take this kill switch with us. We might need it later. And even if we don't, we can give it to Blue. The most important order of business right now is tracking down those meddlesome kids. Let's do it. Take the kill switch, baby. Oh, wait. Now I need to avoid them on the way back? No problem. Why would you turn like that? Why would you turn randomly? No! Oh my god. Oh my god. Cannon Fuhua destroying my computer. Hello? What? How did I get spotted? There was no- there was no robot! Oh my god, why is Phoenix destroying my PC right now? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why are the kids here? Oh, this is where the little thing was, right? Ah, oh, the anomaly's not there. Goodness gracious. 
Phoenix just dashes everywhere. Can I jump? <gasps> no. Where do I need to go? Oh. Hey, wait. Oh my god. <laughs> Who would win? Neatly organized sand or the hottest thing there is? The hottest thing there is, I would say. <laughs> That was me imitating the footsteps, by the way, in case you were curious. <laughs> oh my god, the side story has so many acts. Crazy. Are your hands okay? Yes, my hands are fine. The singe of sizzling electronical, uh, electronical parts and contortion of twisted metal would be enough to unnerve anyone. Yet, I'm fine. See? Not a scratch on me. Sizzling orange's concern, Fruwa chuckled somewhat sheepishly. Sheepishly? and patiently offered her wrist for inspection. Suddenly, the frightened cries of children resounded from the end of the road, followed by intermittent sobbing. Following the sounds, Fuwa found several small children running toward them in panic. It's the kids. How did you end up here? Is everything okay? We're sorry. We shouldn't have planned this prank. Orange, are you hurt? I'm fine. Why would I be hurt? We shouldn't stay here. Let's all follow Miss Fuhua and leave this place, okay? Even after Orange's ex uh, examination was complete, she continues to hold Fuhua's arm tightly with one hand while offering her hand to the three tearful children, leading them toward Chi Ming. Oh my god, that's so cute. Uh, were you the only ones involved in this prank, or were there others? There were others, but we'll talk to them. We'll never do it again. But your accomplices, uh, accomplices, I'm, I mean friends, were they the same age as you? No, we all found different leaflets with challenges on them, and they told us what we had to do. Who was the one handing out the leaflets? We don't know, honestly. We found the leaflets on our desks. I... we really don't know. Sounds like someone sent leaflets to the kids to collaborate on this prank. No kids have entered the museum so far, so perhaps the Mastermind's goal lies elsewhere? But what for? Is this all being done just to harass city representatives? Um, I'm blaming... I'm blaming Mr. Man. What was his name? Moriarty. Orange consoled the child while Fufa's mind swirled with unanswered questions. Even though Orange considers this whole thing as just a prank that got out of control, is it really that simple? Probably not. Probably not. Okay. Um, so there was like three different decisions there? No, there was just two different decisions. Okay, so that led to mysteries. Oh, there would have been... Oh, what the heck? So because I chose the, a different one, I didn't... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Yeah, time for the other routes. Okay, so let's go here. And this was... What was the choice here? Oh, this was... Oh, wait, can I skip? Will we go to the choice? Uh, take out... Okay, we did bypass before, so let's take out the security boss. And this one's gonna be what? Is this one voiced? Is it really okay? No problem. Relax. We'll find the kids in no time. Alright, let's do it. Let's see what we got. Everybody group up. Or don't group up. That's fine too. I will just turn, my, turn myself into a torpedo. Well, we are definitely going to get there faster. That's for sure. <laughs> Fuhua's animations are so good. I'm so sad I didn't get the new Fuhua. Oh my god. She looks so cool. Garuda Fuhua. Whoa. The broken rock pieces it stirred up are dangerous. Be careful, Orange. I got your back. One Man Army, I just realized, is the name of this. 2-9? What the hell? How did we go to 2-9? Are your hands okay? Yes, I'm okay. Uh, is this the same? We're sorry, shouldn't have played this prank. Wait a second. What was the difference there?
Um. Okay. Okay. Illusion of choice. Illusion of choice. Love that. There was quite literally no difference there. Um, okay, so now this one. <clears throat> I don't remember there being a choice here. What was the choice on this? Avoid the security mechas. Um, you already had that ending? Yeah, it's just... I saw that there, were, there was the empty choice. Oh, okay. Okay. But you're right. It did just lead to the same ending. Okay, so last time I went... I went for the main switch. But this time I need to not go to the main switch. Hello. After finally making it to the end of the path, there was no sign of anyone. It was a dead end with nothing but an ironclad door that a gaggle of children couldn't possibly have passed through. We're too late. Don't be sad. You've already done so much for me. None of this concerned you in the first place, yet you still put your best foot forward and tried your utmost to help. Although uh, although Orange by all rights should have felt the most frustrating in, the, in that moment, she insisted... Uh, she instead pushed down her anxiety and disappointment and focused on comforting Fuhua. That's so cute, but also sad. As she watched Orange bite her lip and put on a facade of indifference while comforting her, it was more than Fuhua could bear. The children had to have passed through here. They must have left some kind of trace. Um, I believe we still have a chance of finding them. The footprints went to the platform... Went to the platform without exit and circled around. No one could be found. The communicator beeped and Orange took a look. Green's got something. Um, please don't tell me the kids just actually disappeared. Based on Green's clues, Fuhua and Orange continued to trail after the kids, ending up all the way in the residential area. On a street, they found a dirty and disheveled child peeking around. Io, Darn it, it's Orange. The boy was about to scurry off, but Fuhua stepped forward, blocking his path. Are you behind all these pranks? Orange unfolded the two pieces of paper, seeing them. The boy immediately lowered his head. I'm sorry. We wanted to see who could find the basement first and put this note inside it. How did you find the basement? Huh? So there really is a basement? So the map wasn't lying after all. So who gave them the map? I'm scared of the dark and everyone kept saying how there was a bunch of scary monsters inside so I never actually went in. I followed the map's markings and stuffed paper notes in between the gaps of nearby manhole covers. I figured that one of them would have to end up in the basement, then maybe I could win. Damn. I don't know anything about that. All I've been doing is hunting down more manhole covers and seeing where I could stuff more paper notes. The boy shrugged with his sleeves heavily stained. He appeared to be telling the truth. So apart from the notes, everything else was just a coincidence? Don't think you can get off scot-free with a quick explanation, Io. You have no idea how seriously your actions have impacted others. Some pranks can go too far. Your behavior has, uh, has severely disrupted... Orange started to sternly lecture the child, who stood a full head taller than her, but Fuhua still had lingering doubts. Something isn't adding up. Don't tell me that's the ending. Okay, no. Various enigmatic clues had been scattered across seemingly unrelated locals. Uh, and there was no readily apparent or logical thinking... Or sorry, logical uh, thorough line connecting any of them. Fuwa could only observe as Orange admonished the child, who seemed to begin to grasp the severity of his actions. Okay, I know I was wrong. I promise I won't pull any pranks anymore. Good, that's what I want to hear. Don't let me catch you getting up to any more of this in the future. <laughs> Actually reprimanding her child. <laughs> Orange's expression softened. Seeing this, the boy gave a vague response and then quickly ran off. Encompassing Vita disrupted her own monologue and turned to Fuwa. At any rate, I believe we've officially cracked the case. Thanks for your help. However, I really need to talk to Green about greater safety education for the kids, so I don't think I'll be able to show you around. It's okay. I'm glad I could help. I can explore the city on my own anyway. Okay, then. Goodbye. Um, I don't like that ending. Because we never found the kids. There literally was no kids there. Why did that happen? 
Okay, so how do I get the other ending? Oh, is it because I messed up, maybe? I still need to do the kill switch. Is that what it is? This one, I need to actually get the kill switch and not get caught. That must be it. Because I have no idea what else it would be. Get out of my way. I like how I literally push the robot out of the way. Don't turn this way. Don't turn this way. Whew. Oh my god. Vita just scared the shit out of me. She, I, I don't know why. That actually jump scared me when she turned that corner. <laughs> Got it. The main switch. Let's go. Now we can shut down the security machines. Okay. With the orange leading the way, they managed to locate the kill switch. Nicely done. Uh, Fuha throwing back the kill switch. Nothing happened. Right, right, right. Okay, so we have the kill switch now. So I need to not get caught. But also, what's going over here? <laughs> what's up, Amir? Goodbye, Amir. <laughs> nice shave. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. Okay, don't turn on me. Oh, see, he did turn. Why did he turn? Wait, can I just... Okay, incredible. Incredible. Okay, so we have the kill switch. And now... What the freaking frick? Okay. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Hello? Don't turn, don't turn, don't turn. Okay, you're gonna, like, be right up on me. Right, right, right. Run. Book it, book it. Okay, so now we have the actual kill switch, which I don't really know how that helps us here. <clears throat> We're too late, don't be sad. No, this just leads to the same ending, doesn't it? Yeah, this is the same ending. Interesting. Wait, so what do I need to do there? Oh! Wait, no, I did do it? Okay, uh, let me reread this. Fuhua took out the kill switch and upon closer uh, examination of uh, the sides, noticed that there were that there were indications of it being opened. After a moment of hesitation, she pried open the kill switch. <sighs> Is it another note? Fuwa took out a small, rolled-up piece of paper from the interior of the kill switch. She glanced at the boy nearby. His nervous expression had already given him away. Clearly, he had something to do with this. This is all for the challenge? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> She's angry. <laughs> After a torrent of uh, castigation, the crying boy was picked up by his parents who had rushed over. Orange finally calmed down and debriefed Fuhua on the truth of the incident. Right. <laughs> but Fuhua still wasn't entirely convinced. 
あの子たちが把握している情報量と特にコントロールスイッチのような存在は代理人やわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわたしゅうわた精一杯私の世話をしようとしているなんてオレンジさん。ブワーズ、カンボイス、インタラプテッド、オレンジズ、フラスター、ラブリング、シー、ロックアップ、ブリンクアップ、私はオレンジさんの力になりたいから、一緒に行動していたのです。オレンジさんも、この町も、違法人の私を受け、あなたのことが心配なんです。あ、シーズ、ウォーリー、私が心配。Because you never think about yourself。オレンジさんは人の世話に慣れていて、常に他人のために行動して、心配しています。私と共に旅していた復帰の書という友人もそういう人あなたは彼女と同じです。I've said that so many times, 世話を役側に慣れてしまい、自分自身も誰かに支えられる必要があることを忘れています。そこが心配なんです。ふかさん。子供たちのことで落ち込んでいるのに、私の機嫌まで気にするなんて、あの子たちのことはオレンジさんのせいじゃありません。Their curiosity just got the best of it. Uh huh, sure. Orange san no kotoba o kariruto, mo jubun gambati masio. It even said Fuwa doesn't believe that. <laughs> oh, no, don't cry. No, <laughs> that's also a new, a new, a new animation. Encompassing Vita buried her head in Fuhua's chest. <laughs> it should have been me. I'm kidding, I'm sorry. And it was a while before she lifted it again. When she did, the gloom in her eyes had vanished and had been replaced by her usual uh, uh, effervescent ebulence. <laughs> Holy shit, <laughs> <laughs> big words. Fuka <laughs> san, Aww. Aww. It was Cyan who secretly asked me to look after you. <laughs> You're not a failure as a guardian. <laughs> That's so I need to let everyone know how much I love them. Chad, I am not prepared for whatever they're about to do to the seven of these children. Because I know, I know, I know something is going to happen. This is Honghai. <laughs> something terrible are going to happen to these kids, and I'm not ready. I am not ready. Okay, so I can do this one, right? Oh, no, I can't. Oh, I can unlock these two. I can do these two after. Okay, okay. All right, chat. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm getting a little tired. I'm getting a little tired, but it's fine. We shall continue. We shall continue. You should break the pillars before going to the box. You made it, uh, you made it three times harder, <laughs> but it was fun to watch. Honestly, it wasn't even that hard. I just messed up one time. I didn't know I could break the pillars though. <laughs> All right. Let us continue, shall we? Main story. Continue. Glad we have enough stamina. We have plenty of stamina. When Fuhua was awakening the Ark from deep uh, in her memory, what? Someone else was quietly taking in everything that had happened in the dark. I like how it just mentioned the arc. It was, like, that was kind of out of nowhere. <laughs> I mean, I guess I guess most players would have assumed that it was the arc, but for those that don't know what the arc is, that might have been a little confusing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Breaking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I assumed you meant the breaking or sneaking past part. I just didn't realize that you could break the pillars. <laughs> Although I'm assuming that's what it was trying to tell me when it was saying the phoenix thing. 
that I could break shit. <laughs> and I just didn't listen. Uh, in Hesperus ruins, he gazed into the distance and wore a thin smile. Oh. Return to the prison on your fourth day of release. Uh -huh. Refrigeration. Oh, odd. Oh, oh, did Fuhua end up waking up Moriarty? Detectors are better suited to deal with me. Uh-huh. Right. Oh, is it because she said his name? Girly said his name and he was like, hey, yo. <laughs> Dude, what a sick. Oh my god. Let's go. What a sick shot. Oh. <笑>彼はそんな人というより狡猾な犯罪者でした。彼にとって犯罪は過ちではなく、芸術と。Who <笑> I'm surprised Fuha wouldn't have noticed that if he was. Well, that's just his eyes moving around. <laughs> oh, mindful Vita. Oh, we have outfit. We have outfit. As onlookers, it was only natural that Orange and um, Cyan would think that way. The young boy spoke and interpreted the happy memories of reunion with old friends. This is blue. Oh, is this? Yes, that's blue. You're <laughs> せんかくのビータ。君の心配は理解できるよ。最も聡明な彼が賢い選択をしたと思いきや、身を置いてからその中に隠された愚かさに君がその考えを気にしていなくてもそれは君たち7人の関係に影響を及ぼす。オッケー
インディゴ私たちはこれからどうすればいいの現状を維持しようあのフカという名の違法人は彼とは違う彼女の危険な一面は本人ですら気づいていないところに彼女こそがふさわしいと適切はイコールじゃないよ君は少しも手加減しないねしかし好奇心と求知心は人類そして僕たちのようにその本性を自己実現へと消化できる存在は実に少ない。よく考えてみて僕たちが真実のために奔走しているさなかに多くの人たちの目に映っているのは衣食、安全、愛情だけだ。彼らは全力を尽くしても社会での自分の些細なポジションを守れない。Bro's talking shit? それは自慢すべきことなのかなそれともあなたはもうご飯を食べなくてもいいし、秘密基地に隠れなくてもいいってこと<笑>君の話は一理あるね。それなら今の話は。Okay. I agree. They are odd. I don't know if you should trust this person. I don't get very trusting vibes from this person. <laughs> Oh, purple knows you? So it's a Kimito Kanojan, a Himitz Tatanoko. Himitz Janayo? Motomoto Mina, you say you to Motetakedo, ye timing. We decided to tell everyone from the beginning, but the perfect opportunity never arose. Oh, what is going on? Okay, so is there an entire secret plan between all the Vitas? But would you trust this person? No. No. <laughs> Oh, wait, is this not the dude in the museum? Okay, this might not be the dude from the museum. I assumed it was, but now I'm thinking with the way that they do names, it would probably just say Moriarty here if it was actually him. The repertoire? Brother! Who? Who? Um, how should she put her current mood into words? After an eternity of silence, she still couldn't find the answer. Perhaps she felt some premonition when she saw that strangely familiar and huge building that was referred to as Forbidden Ground. Perhaps when she'd first set eyes on the bridge with that, uh, with the fracture right below it, she should have anticipated that this sigh would escape her own throat at some point. Anyways, the miracle holding all the hopes, the Ark representing the resolution of the young girl, the spacecraft that lost contact with Earth 1,500 years ago, is trapped in some ruins in the end. Cold as steel. This is actually really upsetting, because right now, Fuhua probably thinks that she died in the crash. ここにあるこの橋は私の友人が設計・製造した宇宙船の一部の物中船深さん、宇宙船って何 At the sight of the question swimming in Orange's eyes, Fuhua confirmed her initial theory again. Despite the presence of convenient urban surveillance equipment, small robots that assist in city management and recording cameras, the technological level here is, was far from the space age. 
Otherwise, Blue, the smartest one among the seven Vitas, wouldn't have said something like, I still have a lot to learn about the structure of this place. A ship into space. Cabin! <laughs> Actually, I'm not gonna lie, that's probably one of the least complicated things. <laughs> Okay, so, so her landing here caused the cataclysm. Oh, had long been underground. Oh, weird, weird. Okay, so did the ship come out of the, the, the port? Like the portal came in the ground? That's why she thinks it was underground. <laughs> she just randomly got teleported underground and bursted out. Oh, okay. Just kidding. They've got theories. Her falling from the sky makes more sense. We need to go in there. The warp atmosphere was completely shattered by those two words, which carried a sense of foreboding. It was at this moment that Cyan realized one of the reasons why Fuhua always uh, furrowed her brow in thought. When in Rome, do as the Romans do. Dude. <laughs> Didn't March literally just say this? Didn't March also just say that? in Right before the Pentagon quest started? You love when characters in Honkai Epic 3rd have their own theories and perspectives? Yeah, it's one of the writing choices that's actually really interesting, and also what a lot of- what confuses a lot of people in Honkai is because they do the- they do the- instead of just, like, actually having one person give the answer of what something is, they write the character to describe what the thing is with their own understanding, which could be completely wrong. And then we'll meet another person that also doesn't have the full understanding, but will explain what they think it is. And then we have two completely conflicting ideas. <laughs> and so it's like one of those things where it's like, we wish we had the real answer. But yes, I agree. I do like the fact that they do that. It does make things a little confusing, but I like the fact that it does that. It gives each character a more personality. But <laughs> Maybe Walt told her about Earth history. I mean, I'm sure Walt would love to talk about Earth. Despite the less than optimistic situation, she still carried a glimmer of hope as she gazed um, at the two young city representatives. <gasps> Name drop. Name drop. Chris Yu. She's a bit older than you. With beautiful, long, light cyan hair. She gestured with her hands, searching hard in her mind for any other information about Grisio. After about a thousand years, all the memories, happy or sad, seemed to be shrouded in a layer of mist, uh, making them appear indistinct and evoking a sense of melancholy. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I will say I have not seen any interactions between Grisio and Fuwa. So I'm going I, I am very excited to actually see this little reunion here. Even her own body would be dotted with paint. <laughs> A very, 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 very loved individual. One of my few peers. Oh my god, that is so sad. After pondering hard and long, the two representatives shook their heads and looked toward Fuhua with a tinge of embarrassment. Mm. 
Okay, what is this enlightenment, enlightenment shit you keep talking about? I've never seen her in enlightenment nor heard about her. Uh, you just be dropping terms. What the shit are you talking about? What's a turnite? Oh, she just be living here? <laughs> oh, yeah, Red is still. Fuwa stood dumbfounded for a second before warmth slowly caressed her heart like a gentle breeze. Even though those two couldn't offer any actual clues, they still uh, they were still trying their best to console her. Oh. A lot more emotion in her voice now that Chris is in the picture. <clears throat> you think it's a city name for some reason? We have three names. The first two I get, uh, but those two I'm not sure. Is it? Because they just randomly said it. And also, earlier, enlightenment was in quotes. Because they said if you could figure out the secret of enlightenment, help them figure out the secret of enlightenment. So this one, I don't know if it's a city name. Well, I mean, maybe it is. Maybe it is. But then this one, this is the first time I ever mentioned a turnite. So I hope you really are fine. Oh my god. Okay, get me to the reunion now. <laughs> get me to the reunion immediately. Investigate. Fuhua took the object in Cyan's hands and dusted it off gently. Oh, is it the paintbrush? Um, then the three stared at the transparent hemisphere that was silently broken on the surface, but perfectly intact inside. Okay. A micro city? What do you mean? Okay. I'm terrified of what's going to happen here. Phosphorus and uh, Hesperus for the Vidas and then Quiming, or uh, Chiming, and yes. I'm not sure about the other two. Yeah, uh, we'll have to see. Uh, the moment Fuhua let go, uh, mellow music came out of the crystal ball while the micro city inside began to move as the music played. A music box. Thanks to Blue's creativity and Purple's skillful hands, Cyan had seen many intricately, uh, intricately designed music boxes, but he had never heard a melody so filled with deep emotion. It came from the distant past, tender like a dream, hazy like the rain. Every sound was filled with deep emotion, and each note was mesmerizing. The ripple of sentiment it sent uh, passing through their bodies was heartbreakingly beautiful, but... Perhaps it was a malfunction of some component inside the crystal ball, but the micro city only operated for a while before suddenly disappearing, with its streetlights going out and leaving nothing but darkness. Despite Fuhua's relentless efforts to restart it, the unfinished music refused to play again. Her mind was haunted by thousands of thoughts and emotions. Fuhua did her best not to reminisce about all her past feelings. Was it just a coincidence? As mellow as fine wine, as sparkly as gold, and able to keep the original tune even after an eternity. But it ended abruptly. Yes, they could fix it, I'm sure. <laughs> Dude, the nod, the nod is so aggressive. A lot of flame chaser references. Yeah, especially with the wine part. Yeah. This is, um... I feel so bad for Fuhua. Because now, now, not only... <laughs> Not only is she in a place she doesn't know, with no contact for her current friends, but now she's getting evidence of her previous friends from literal thousands of years ago. 
And now she doesn't even know if Grisio is alive or dead. I meant to mute my mic before that. I apologize. But I feel so bad for her. Yes. My very first friend. Oh my god. They're just gonna make this even more sad. They're just gonna make this even more sad. Well, don't say that because now you're making it seem like Grisio's body could have been thrown out. <laughs> oh my god! Don't say it! Don't say that! <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's okay. It's fine. Also true. And also, she was more than a human, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. She's special. Perfect. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hello? Oh? Excuse me. Why are you coughing? Oh, don't disregard the coughing. Cyan, why are you coughing? Fua picked up a book off the ground. The cover had vanished and the pages were all stuck together, with the writing long since reduced to blurred inky patches. With that said, she carefully separated the pages that were stuck together. After a long while, she eventually stumbled across a paragraph that was still legible. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, that's a long-ass paragraph. On the morning of the 16th day, before the sun had risen, I picked up my bag, left the shelter, and headed to the beach. Perhaps it was because of the storm yesterday. The creatures on the nameless island were exceptionally lively then. I could always hear rustling noises from above the dense forest. Initially, I did not notice that, as I was in a hurry. However, that sound became noisier. It sounded like several people were holding onto a huge net while jumping back and forth on the trees. I was afraid that I would be their prey, so I did not care to avoid the shell fossils in the wet mud as I ran toward the beach. I only stopped as I winced in pain when the seawater washed over my wound. I looked back. Dozens. Hundreds. No, a huge kaleidoscope of butterflies was swarming toward me. They were going to eat me. After this thought flashed through my mind, I pulled my bag over me and ducked. When the rustling noises were next to my ears, I thought nothing was impossible on this nameless island. <clears throat> uh, yet that rustling only lasted for ten seconds or so. I stood up and watched them from behind in a daze. They flew, toward and, uh, they flew toward the boundless sea as they were scattered by the ceaseless strong winds. Then I finally understood. The butterflies were merely flying, and I happened to be in their way. I don't know why they flew. Maybe it was for, uh, for sweeter nectar. Maybe it was for a beloved mate. Or maybe it was for freedom, which they could not comprehend themselves. I only knew that they must have gone mad, just like me when I insisted on coming to this nameless island despite the consequences. Regardless, I survived another day. On the morning of the 17th day, I went to the beach again. There were no butterfly corpses there, just countless resplendent seashells. The two faces of the seashells seemed like spread wings sparkling in the sand before they disappeared under the tides. Perhaps the sw that swarm of butterflies were already gone. Or perhaps these shells were the butterflies that did not leave this island. What? <sighs> I'll be honest, I didn't know butterflies could mate. Then again, how else would they be born? Hey, hey, some some things are, are self-reproducing. <laughs> Ew, words. <laughs> it's okay, I like reading the words. The Star Rail streams. Where I just go through and read just pages upon pages. Following Orge's fingers, uh, Cyan saw two sentences. 
The shellfish swam into the forests while the butterflies flew into the oceans. Okay, interesting. In the very end, they all found a new home for themselves. And her head covered to cover. Another scientist? Wait, who would have given her that book? Not Mobius, no. Oh. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> Maybe. If you got questions about infinity, why not ask a child of infinite possibilities? Speaking of infinity. Oh, wait. <laughs> I love how we don't even have to think about that in Star World just because we know it's the Synesthesia Beacon. Oh. Yeah, after that line, it's definitely Mobius, yeah. I didn't think it was until she said Infinity. <laughs> God, it's so sick. I thought we needed to break the. <laughs> I thought we needed to break the wall. <laughs> Following orders, lead Fuwa's attention was quickly drawn to something shining red under the ruins. <clears throat> oh shit! Hey yo. Okay. Her heart sank, and a chill ran through her whole body. <clears throat> the jade pendant now grasped in her hand was very important for both Grisio and her. And Grisio always cherished things of great importance, unless... Oh no. Oh no. Fuwa, please. She's okay. <laughs> Don't do this. In a heartbeat, she became lost in her distant memories. It was many years ago, and a perfectly normal day. But thanks to Miss Pink's impulsive proposal, Miss Pink's, the day ended up being pretty special. All of our friends have been giving each other gifts. We should try it too. But since there are 13 of us, don't forget to invite Mobius, Kevin. Uh, gift giving wasn't her strong suit, so she was mulling over what gifts she would give whom before any names were drawn. What would she get the fiery Calpis or the tricky Dr. Mobius? Um, or the one who started it all? Who would accept anything but, um, who would accept anything but was difficult to read? She prepared in every way she could. It would have been a lot easier to give a gift to the more extreme among them. <laughs> the door opens. <clears throat> more words isn't necessarily always good. I prefer the show, not tell kind of storytelling, but I understand sometimes it's inevitable. Yeah, yeah, but I wouldn't really say that that was, was, was a telling. You know what I mean? Like, if it was just a blob of, like, just straight up telling you something, I could... Okay, I see both sides. <laughs> I, up front, I will say, I, I do see both sides. <laughs> uh, but I wouldn't say that that was necessarily like a telling oh. type of deal. Oh! <laughs> Little Grisio! Hello? Of course you are. What are you drawing? What's up? Grisio. In advance. Hua inhaled quietly. It was funny to think that she'd be this nervous in front of Grisio. Oh, an extra gift? Or actually just early? 
After thinking for a while, she could still uh, she still couldn't bring herself to explain. Maybe she couldn't have joined in their gift-giving game after all, and maybe she should have uh, should have thought more deeply about the game's meaning before preparing her gift. Eden was planning on singing a song. <laughs> Let us hear it. Kalpis was going to make a special meal. Their gifts were unique, but didn't go overboard. Then there was hers. She grasped the jade pendant tightly in her hands, and after hesitating for a few seconds, handed it to Grisio. Grisio, Oh my god, look at her little smile. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't mention the fact that she'd been lingering at the doorway for a total of 20 minutes. Oh my god. Wow, why are you so nervous? Oh my god. Oh Oh my god. <laughs> Ellie, why are you spoiling? Oh my god, she didn't even knock. She waited out there for 20 minutes until Grisio opened the door. <laughs> oh my god. プレゼントを渡そうとしないの。シャイ。私の。ゲームのプレゼントに対する理解が。Oh I'm gonna cry. たしいよ。ふわお姉ちゃんのプレゼントは私とふわお姉ちゃんにとって私のプレゼントはふわお姉ちゃんと私にとって大事なものをそうしたらいつでもそうですね。グレーシュの意見に賛成します。Oh my god. Hey chat, remember when they made us <laughs> Remember when they made us play as Hersh of Corruption and and fake out obliterate Grisio? Hated that. The past vanished like a mist. But the broken jade pendant became warmer in her hands, just like that night she spent lingering nervously at that doorway many millennia ago. So this <laughs> Yes, I remember. <laughs> Yeah, I hated that. <laughs> she put the jade pendant away and smiled gratefully at Cyan. But they suddenly heard the roar of monsters and a girl crying for help nearby. Who is over here? No one should be over here. Hersh <laughs> was just trying to survive. Yeah, sure. But... Does oh, uh, red? What? <gasps> oh, I, 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 I got Shadow Knight in Azure Embra. <gasps> I love Azure Embra. Oh my God! Oh, they really did change her. I'm getting two stacks per hit. Bonk. Oh, oh, that one was sick. That one was so sick. You okay? <laughs> Why do you have to remind me? <laughs> yeah, sorry, sorry. My bad, chat. My bad. My bad. Redo-san, <laughs> 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 
Okay, uh, all of the different Vitas, they're not the same voice actress. Like, obviously the blue, Blue's voice actor was different, but... Are they all, uh, do they all have different voice actresses, or is it the same person? They are the same VA? That's crazy. That's crazy, because you can so distinctly tell how different they speak. Like the way that the way they talk. <laughs> and also, hello, hello, knocked. <laughs> how are you? How are you? Thank you for telling me the hours, by the way, earlier. A figure flash across it. そのかげは僕たちと同じでとけ簡単に言えば人に似ていて人に。え、よ。人に。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。
now Fu Hua is only using those terms, and she never used them before. When they heard this, the three city uh, representatives all fell silent and lost in thought. But there was a tacit understanding um, that this was a life and death situation for their world. <laughs> <clears throat> no way. Oh, oh, hey, what's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Changing. How are things going in Chiming? Why do they keep switching? I mean, I, I it's not confusing to me. I understand it now. Like I understand what they all are. It's just so weird that they're that they're doing that. キミは相変わらずせっかちだ。まず軽名の方だけど、僕とバイオレットはすでに避難誘導を済ませ、バリケードも設置した。それと、負荷が以前頑張ってくれたおかげで、現在人気ごと言えるの方は。Okay, they were last seen in the museum. So had they not seen them in like days? Oh no, I was right. So they, they did get there earlier. I was right. But they've known him for days? Okay, so, oh, okay, okay, okay. So that must not be the dude. That must not be the dude in the Moriarty, or whatever his name was. That can't be. That must have been a different person that they were with. どうしたんだ。いえ。何も持って。そんなわけないでしょ。大声でダメですって叫んでたじゃない。そうですね。Why? <laughs> uh, is their tongue but not Fuqua, so I guess they stopped using it. Yeah, no. I mean, that makes sense as to why cuz they said that they they wanted to record it and start using that anyway. Uh Fuqua's Virgins. Your intuition? Well, you did say they did already set up the fact that your gut is pretty, pretty accurate, so. With that, Purple had completely deflated Red's initial enthusiasm. <laughs> she couldn't ignore the power of Purple's intuition. Okay, Purple's intuition is, is apparently incredible. Although her intuition failed her every once in a while, Purple never lost when playing rock, paper, scissors with orange and with blue, who wasn't there at the moment. Eye contact, rhythm, verbal cues as players get ready. Uh, the player's mental state, even the dexterity of one's hands could influence the outcome. Meanwhile, Purple didn't need to think about any of these things. Whenever she played, her victory was assured. それでも負荷を連れて行ってみる価値はあると思うよ。リツちゃんも言ってたよね。現在異変はしばらく収まった状態って。だからこそ、この隙に調査をガンガン進めて一刻も早く事態を解決するべきだよ。オッケー。そうい
な手がかりにしがみついて待ち続けるなんて<笑>これで賛成は2票だね Are we about to outvote purple? 僕もレッドに賛成するよ深さんはいろいろ手伝ってくれたしさっきはレッドのことも助けてくれたそれに彼女の仲間も不可能<laughs> companions? Yes, my lost companions. Cyan shared a detailed account of Fuhua's theories and what they found along the way. They showed them Fuhua's theory videos. You're not only unable to enter from an area, but you also have no idea what's on the inside. True, and then she could report it back to you. Let's go, Fuhua. Let's go. Always tell the truth, chat. Always tell the truth. So they like physically do they just get like recoiled out like a barrier? So they just straight up can't enter. Oh no, it loops them back out. Oh, that's interesting. If you don't get lost inside and come back out the door you enter, then that means you've been successful. Ah. Oh. No, 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 that's fine. <laughs> okay, let's just ask. Hey, Purple, can we go inside? Thank you. No. 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 Might be a key turning point. Right. 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 I guess I'm not that surprised. Actually, this is going to persuade Purple. So it doesn't matter. It's going to be unanimous anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 I'm sure you will also be sad, not just Orange Cyan. So then, you can get the same thing. I'm going to get the same thing. I'm going to get the same thing. All right. Into the forbidden we go. She wants a word with purple alone. I'm going to get the same thing. I'm going to get the same thing. Oh, can I talk to them? Can I eavesdrop? Oh, I can. Yes, I can. So, yeah, because I'm epic. Because I'm epic. Smart. The great detective Fuhua. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> I love that animation. Uh, why? Because you're a detective. Power. <laughs> Yes, you do look like a comic book detective. 
優秀な探偵は最も精錬された言葉で事件の真相を導く存在勘ではバイオレットちゃんに劣ってるかもしれないけどあだ名をつけるのが好きなだけだろええー、そうそれより不可レッドと住民たちを助けてくれてありがとう Anytime, literally. さっきは少し耳の痛い話をしてしまったかもしれないとにかくくれぐれも気をつけて分かっていますグリーンさんリツちゃんはいつも真面目すぎるから尊敬はされるけどみんなと親しくなれないんだ<笑>君もあまり変わらないんじゃないかええー、それはリツちゃんが無自覚なアドーブルバイオレットまだ何か話したいことがあるの私は別にそうでもありませんあ、oh, グーリー Sounds like you're hesitating there 本当<笑>博物館で何か見つけたんでしょ動く石それともおしゃべりできる投影 Wait,、uh, wait, did we go in with purple? Was purple with us originally? When we went in the museum? I don't think so, right? オレンジ姉さんどうして違いますそのつまり Oh, no, 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 no. It was, it was, uh... No, no, it was purple and green that went to check it out after the logs. That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Purple was with green. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Violet? Shit? Uso ga heta na no ni. Dou shite mo himitsu o mamori tai toki wa. Hatsure ko. Isso no koto iye. Who doesn't give anyone a chance to chime in? So na no. Hai, hai. Mo kore i chou wa sagura nai kara. Sore ni shite mo. Soko no o nae sa. Oh! Me no mae de ni sui dake nan te. Not me. <laughs> Not me. What are you talking about? <laughs> that's that's amazing. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Did that actually affect anything? The fact that I listened to him. Let's go. Let's do it. No, 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 no. 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 No, no, Building. Abnormal was the first word to spring into Fuhua's mind at the sight of this place. Similar to the architectural style of enlightenment, the entrance of the forbidden area also had a very modern lock hole device embedded in the seemingly ancient brick wall. Under the giant lock hole was a thick door made from some kind of metal. Walking in from. What? I can't read. Walking in front of the door, Fuhua bent over and looked around for a while. <laughs> Hundreds of years. <laughs> Not too long after our new home was built. Yeah, that must be what happened. Oh my god, Detective Fuhua. After everything they've experienced together, she could hardly entertain the second explanation. Instead, she just became a little more alert to the forbidden area itself. Oh, 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 wait, hold on, hold on. Because I did bring up the fact that the Vitas may have a plan themselves. Who was it that Yellow told? Blue and yellow, when they were talking to Mystery Man, said that they. Did they say that they told everyone immediately? Does everyone know? There are two interpretations of Green's theory that Vita, uh, Vitas can't enter the Forbidden Area. Mm. 
たった1回。Oh, they said they were going to, but didn't get the chance. Okay, I got you. 2回だけどね。<笑>その後は扉の裏にある世界を禁足地として、以前から何度も強調されていた町の代理人のルール。それはおそらく。違反してはならない何かのそうでなければ私を禁足地に入らせるかどうかを話し合う必要なそその通りだよ<笑>私はただ皆さんが話していたことを簡単に整理しただけですでも,もし私が入れるとしたら皆さんが禁足地に入れない問題を解決<笑>禁足地は町の代理人であるあなたたちを拒んでいると先ほど言ってましたよね。禁足地はあなたたちのためにあるのだと思う。Yeah, ああ、ワクワク、大丈夫ですか ？Head hurt？ お母さん、ありがとう。Oh, we were still w a l あちこちに石ころが転がってますね。<笑>うん、そうだ。いろいろ話したけど。All right, let's do it。ではワクワク。Let me in。Oh, blue thought yellow、I、had to talk to purple. Okay, got you. As if responding to Fuwa's encouragement, Erudite took a step forward and stood before the door. He clenched his fist and took a deep breath as he raised the key in front of his chest. Huge, let's go. I thought it would maybe light up in his color. But no, it just lit up. Door open. The curtain of light emitted from inside the gate gradually surrounded Fu Hua until it swallowed her whole.、Uh, Cyan counted in his head. Based on his past experience, they would definitely return to the same spot within one minute, guided by the misty veil of light. But now, five minutes had already passed. Fu Hua was doing it, and he was doing it. He was doing it. He was doing it. Wouldn't you have also returned in the first minute, though? Uh oh. Uh, uh oh. Did you fall? <laughs> Lifting his palm, Cyan saw blood, but this time he, pay he had paid attention while walking. Was were you tripped? Oh no. Oh no. Don't tell me that they. Who was going to come out of here and they're going to be dead? <laughs> this is not going to be good. <laughs> I don't trust this. I don't trust this at all. Why are you making them bleed? No, there's a reference object right there. Whatever is floating. So t h a i k u t a o b i r a m i t i s h m a t a s a k i n i s u m i m a s h o Too quick. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Like I said, this is Honkai. <laughs> Oh, okay. Holy shit. Oh, fun! Oh, fun! A standalone bubble universe? Or、oh, the remnants of what I was gonna say? Quantum enemies. Very fun. Okay. Hold on. Real quick, on this one, I thought it was three and then two, is it not? Oh. Oh, is it just the. Oh, default skill. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or no, no, no. Okay, just kidding. Dude, I love the animations of her just bouncing everywhere. Literally, just everywhere all at once. And now I'm Detective w a g e n Oh, what the shit? Was that Vita? <gasps> I saw Vita's heels. What the shit? That was so weird. Oh. 
Hello? <laughs> the moment her finger made contact with the person, a prickling pain ensued. Um, Fuhua instinctively recoiled, but the torrent formed by countless images had rushed into her mind with a deafening roar accompanying the pain. Hi, hi. So this is Fuhua's first time seeing Vita. ギシン、何があったのか教えてくれないなら、もう行っちゃうよ。あ、違う。本当に行くよ。日が暮れた後に。え、やだ。昨日の夜、パトロールが終わった頃に、シュウちゃんが僕の知らないおもちゃと遊
夜になったらもう一度しゅうちゃんと話してみるえ<笑>謝るわけじゃないよただちゃんと話したくてだって知らんそうだね<笑>ウフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフ Unless you are happy alone. <laughs> Don't try and find happiness in another person. You need to find it in yourself first, because otherwise you're just going to burden the person that you're trying to be with. Just saying. Trust her and follow the light or go my own way. Can I actually choose that? Is that an actual option? I don't like the fact that f go my own way was in red text. I'm gonna follow green text. This is Vita talking to us. Oh, just kidding, it's V. Okay, so this is a different version of Vita? So we have Vita, we have V, as in just the letter V, and then we have V, which is VI, and then we have Saw. <laughs> oh, the first loophole. Uh, because she gave it to us. Uh, you look like a star. Yeah, a beacon of light. Oh, is it actually based off the person's imagination? Oh, okay. もちろん、幻覚の現れ方は君自身コンソールの方は初めから現実に存在しているものだよ。巧みに仕掛けるのは、バグを拡大させることで、幻覚を引き裂き。So she is still inside. I'll enter the bug through your touch. Okay. Uh, sounds really risky and that we would have to put a lot of trust in you. Yes. <laughs> and that's not even trust issues, dog. That's just you being sus as hell. <laughs> ですが全員を示した後にいや、ま、だそれはあんたがまあ、フォーバー。しかしどの道今は住宅の余地がありません。あ、もうユクジスワークアウト。ですから。ビーさん。レッツゴー。了解。了解。アフターワイルドサイレ
It's too small to offer more, but give me more! Find the next terminal now! Escape from the mist. Okay. Yeah, let me just no longer. Oh, god damn it! You accidentally triggered the the auto defense. Let's go. Woohoo! Oh, keep going, keep going. You need to switch into detective. Of course I am. Or the quantic creatures. Quantic. <laughs> I love the word quantic. Sounds complicated. <laughs> okay. I like I like just the quick agreeance. どうやら彼女との距離が短くなってきたようです。不可。ごめん。前みたいに手をガバンに乗せて。オッケー。イツアキャンバス。わかりました。レッツゴー。エンエンスタンスでミスト she didn't paint this world into existence, did she? Pakatteru. Demo.絵筆を握ってるのはそれに見たことがあるの。みんなが自分の絵筆で昔の人はちょっと違ってた。あの頃のみんなは色を一つや二つしか持ってなかったの。でも今この星には誰も住んでいない。白は超大切だからあらゆ
At the base of the mountain, lights started to shine one by one with the common hustle and bustle, as well as the once ordinary souls. And during the Ark's recuperation period. Um, should I know what that is? I don't remember there being a Ark recuperation period. Oh, hello. An audio log? 1261。約 it's covered by snow made from methane. Yakusanze この星に着陸した理由は種をまくためじゃなくて今後の探索に向けて資源を補給するためマービンには火星と似てる場所を見つけたなんて理由で勝手に休眠を中止してどこにでもあるような星で。I'm going to assume still that Marvin is kind of like an onboard AI on the on the ship. But also, Fuha would probably know that, because she seemed like... Okay, so did she meet a Vita on Mars? Okay, wait, it was Mars, right? Now I'm getting confused with the translation thing that was happening. No, 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 she's from Venus. Right? No, she's from Venus. The Mars thing is part two. Mars is part two. But, but, v or saw is from Venus, right? Correct? Oh, this is actually saying Mars, though? Okay. Oh, wait, did she say last? Oh, yeah, the last book. Okay. Vita and Saw is Venus. Okay, great. Love that. Thank you for clarifying. <laughs> looks dangerous. Yeah, it does look a little dangerous. It looks like the portal to go to the Sea of Quantum. Bonk. What if Grisio names her paintbrush Marvin? Uh, maybe. Force unlock the dormancy capsule. Is this what she crash landed? Oh shit. Oh? Oh? Oh shit! <gasps> oh? Why are this? I mean, Vita, right? Sky people. I got you. Like I'm a villain. Are you not a villain? Oh my god, there's so many! Boop. 
どうしてグレーシュのことを知っているんですそれも仕事の内容まで分かっているようですねあちゃあ偽物探偵だと思っていたけどどうやら洞察力はかなりのものだ、ね、of course I have actual eyes bro come on man why am I getting no SP? You think I'm weak? You think I'm weak? No, no, Fuhua does not know Vita. Oh shit. Seizing? You're seizing my mind? Yeah, please don't do that. おお。別に大したことでもないし。ちょっとくらい聞いてくれたって。おう。グレーシュに会えないのは残念だけど、安心して。彼女は無事だよ。Dude, <laughs> Queen. You're a natural thespian. Okay, so here's what's going through my mind, right? This is a different. This is a different Vita. Also, I forgot to unpin the message. So sad. Including the voice recordings on the art. Okay, so this is... Uh, okay, uh, this is separate from the, the Vita, the, the nice Vita that we knew in Salt City. This is also different from Saw. Like, the actual Saw. But this one's also evil. あそこにあるのが心身状態だけどな。体を貸してくれないなら、ここは一旦お別れとしよう。おう。What?You I'm going to also assume that this Vita was different from the Vita that was actually talking to the tiny Vitas. Oh my god, so many Vitas. Did that even make any sense? And maybe that's why they can't go in here. Because the actual Vita that's mothering them doesn't want them to be corrupted by the evil Vita that's in here. Just before she was about to witness the truth, her heartbeat quickened. The myriad of thoughts pouring from her mind made her unusually calm at this moment. <sighs> She was prepared, no matter what kind of form a truth will appear in. Here it is. <laughs> I hope they'll actually explain why she grew up. Oh, they don't show? They don't show her? Oh, wow. Damn, that must have sucked, huh? <laughs> they just actually cucked you until chapter 41? <laughs> Damn, unfortunate. Unfortunate. You recommend replaying this stage and this time walking away? Okay, uh, was it... I'm assuming it was the final one, yes? Forbidden Grounds, is it this right here? Let's see. <laughs> wakey, wakey, Greasy, oh, it's time for school. <laughs> yeah, um, don't tell me if they do actually explain it, because obviously that would be a spoiler. But I really hope that they explain why she actually grew up. 
because technically, as far as I'm aware, that should not have been possible due to the surgery. She should have been stuck at the same age. So, I mean, obviously there could be some space shenanigans. Look at that damage. Bonk. <laughs> this was so sick. Okay. Run. Run. Okay, so now we get to walk away, right? I'm pretty sure this is uh -oh. You actually enjoyed beating them? Of course I enjoyed beating them. Oh, oh, I don't know what you're saying. I don't know what you're saying. Oh, okay. Then, you should go no. no. We explore my own again. Uh, yeah, I'll keep walking away. Mitsuyanai <laughs> Oh no. <gasps> oh! Torrents, uh, torrents of a myriad of images flooded into her brain again. <laughs> Roy G. Biv! Green, blue, oh my god. Violet, no present. <笑>別に順番に並んで座る必要はないんじゃないかな。僕たちは町の代理人だよ。町の代理人だからこそ定期は大事。その通りです。はあ。へへ。言えろじゃん。ギャフンと言わせられる印字語はいつ見て。今は
アメを食べたら私たちを叱れなくなると思ってるのかもしれません。That she can't control us after she eats the candy. バイオレット、そんなこと全然思ってないよ。どうやらバイオレットはイエローと一緒にいる時間が長すぎたようだね。<笑>それじゃあ、アメを食べない理由を教えてくれる私は。ビタ姉さんからもらった飴はとても甘ったからこそ。Oh, you're worried you'll eat it all. Oh. 飴は口に入れるとすぐになくなっちゃう。だからみんながいっぱい食べられるように。Always thinking about other people before herself. This is so sad. 文社は相変わらずだね。飴はすぐ口の中で溶けちゃうけど、その記憶があれば飴のない日でも。毎日の目覚めの時に明日や明後日に希望をまあ僕としては雨のない日には甘い香りをそうすれば君にとって僕は雨のようにスイートな存在になるね。Also, uh, it's also like she said,、uh, it will take forever for you to come back again. Yeah, well, because okay, so this Vita goes traveling. I don't think this is. Bad Vita. Because this Vita seems too nice. Don't tell me you don't see that it's a grown up Vita. <laughs> you might run into a horror story? Yeah, let me run into that horror story. What are you talking about, girl? Let me run into that horror story. It might open up a new path. Oh, uh -huh. Um, at the start of the torrent,、um, composed of countless images, there was an elusive phantom. It rode the current and walked slowly toward Fuhua until they united as one. The second I open my eyes, I have to be an outgoing, friendly girl who's equally shrewd and oblivious. It's disheartening, very disheartening. <laughs> Being oblivious makes a flawless person more adorable. <laughs> Mariah said that I'm like them! Oh my god, wait! So it is. Wait, it is Saha. Wait, 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 no, 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 no. Because she. Our Vita spoke to Mariah. Right? That I'm like them, the one before. Nitteru?Bokutachiva?Bokura <laughs> Uh -huh. Wait, so 
Okay, this is not, this is not, this is not our Vita, though. Proxy spoke to Mariah. She uh, took Saul's old name, Vita, if you're referring to chapter 39. That is what I'm referring to. Because I'm trying to figure out if this is Saw or if this was our Vita. I don't think it's, I, I don't think it's Proxy, right? Okay, that's a better way to refer to our Vita, is Proxy. But I don't think this is Saw either. But she did mention Mariah. I think this is just a different clone, though, because there, there's more, there's more clones, right? Saw made more clones. A child's soft voice is interrupted. Uh, a child's soft voice interrupted my thoughts. Me? じゃあ、お姉さんの名前は僕初めまして。僕の名前はビタ。君の名前についてはそうだ。You're <笑> I'm really good at coming up with names. <laughs> patience. You learned patience, huh? Patience. 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 Because well, she was lonely. She is lonely. If she's like any of the other proxies, or the one proxy that we know. So now I only have the option to follow her? Or can I still run away? She meant it literally. <laughs> okay, so now I have to follow. So is this just going to skip to the... You should be thankful I'm a patient person. <laughs> oh, yeah? あなたは誰ですか? Does this just start the normal conversation? There's no way after Fuhua. No, 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 no. This is different. Isn't it? Oh, that because there's no way Fuhua would trust this after seeing all that. Okay, so that's the same. Interesting. That's really weird that after seeing all that Fuhua would still like actually I mean I get it, I get it, I get it. But first of all, also the fact that you could miss all that is crazy. Like, if you don't do that, like I did, and then you don't go back and do this, <laughs> you would have missed quite a lot. Oh, wait. Wait, did that happen the first time? I don't think I had the little QTE the first time. Uh-oh. Is this all the same, by the way? Is all this dialogue the same? 
Is there another, like, is, is it slightly different now that I did that first? At all? It's interesting that they did that. I, I mean, obviously, they kind of wanted you to go through and actually do both of the instances, and I think that's why they have the... I think that's why they have the side missions, is to kind of get you in the, the process of... Are you asking? Just tell me if something is different or not, because otherwise, I don't see the point in going through all of it again. Like, I would just skip. But if there is something that is different from the route that we just did past what we already did, then let me know. Oh, so now that I have that little backstory thing, though, I am seeing this dialogue having a different meaning. So is she kind of using the... Is this where she, like, raises the proxies? Do these different colors end up being proxies for different missions? That I'm not asking, don't answer. Uh, audio log's the same. Yeah, yeah, it is, okay. You don't think it's different? Yeah, that's really interesting. Uh, but anyway, what was I saying before? I think that's why they did the side missions, is to make you get into the, the process of being like, oh, there are different, you know, there's different routes that we can go down. That way you would go back and do stuff. Interesting that she says that we won't let her have the avatar. As in, like, using us as an avatar? Because now I'm trying to think, like, she has the form when she's talking to the other Vitas, right? So is that just because she's able to go into the mind of the other Vitas and kind of project herself having a body? Or does she have to stay in this liminal space until she gains enough energy to actually have a physical form? And that's why it takes her so long to come back. Because in the museum, there was the notebook of V. Which, correct me if I'm wrong, but when it was just V, it was actually Saw, right? Didn't Saw go by V, like just the letter V? And the little flashback thing? Or am I thinking of the proxy V? Okay, right, so this is the same. Oh, that's interesting. When it, when it showcased... Because it went through all of her personalities, right? When it showcased Sinti, wasn't there a part where Sinti had, like... She didn't, didn't she, like, hold her head? And she was like, wait, something's happening to Fuwa. <laughs> so this was happening at that time, I guess? Oh, wait, was that different? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, that is the same. 
Finishing. I have to go now. Bye, everyone. Thank you for, for being here. I appreciate it. <laughs> have a good one. Have a good one. Um, was that the fallen star Kira found? A pen with V. Oh, 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 oh. Right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pen, yeah, Kira found the pen. Which was... That did end up being Saw, though. How good is I'm pretty sure. Okay, sick. Hell yeah. Well? Uh, we have... Technically two more side missions. Um, do you guys want to have this on on stream the side stories or can i do these off stream you let me know i'm gonna go to the bathroom very quickly i'll be right back <laughs> <clears throat> You'd love to see them. You're down with whatever. How much longer are they? Because this one had three. I'm just wondering because I, I do have work in the morning. And I just don't know how much longer this is. Like, it'll be if we do these on stream. <laughs> this year's celebration. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I guess they wouldn't be too long. I guess they wouldn't be too, too long. And these daily things are just for farming, huh? What are these? What is this? Oh, just other ways to farm, I guess? And these are kind of just like trials. Just to like see how good you are at Fuhua. Just more farming? Okay. Well, let's level her up because she's goaded. Everything not side story is farming. Okay, got you. That makes things easy. Uh, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of freaking damage.
Oh, did she also get the... Oh! Their level is linked. I see, I see, okay. When do I unlock this? Oh, at level 30. Okay. Crazy. Well, that's all leveled up. <laughs> this is at 21. That's at 11. Can be continued after breaching the limit. Oh, okay. I see. So you have to get all of them to level 10, and then you can go to level 20. Cool. Okay, um, I think I'm going to do the side stories um off stream just because i do need to sleep before work so i do apologize about that but um we are going to be doing chapter 41 tomorrow the moment i get home from work so around 3 30 p.m cst um we'll be starting chapter 41 so for those that are new around here I don't know if there is, I don't think anybody is new around here, but if you are and you want to watch tomorrow, <laughs> uh, my Discord and my Twitter links are in the description. I always say when I go live next on there, um, but tomorrow, just be here tomorrow. You'll see the notification. We'll be doing chapter 41. Sunday, we'll be doing chapter 42. Very pog. Um, tomorrow is going to be a much longer stream because I'm pretty sure it's, uh, what, like, I think it's going to be around eight hours tomorrow because chapter 41 is, is longer. Um, and then Sunday is going to be like a 10 hour stream again, because that one's really long, but we made good time today. I really thought that the stream was going to be about seven hours, but we were, we were, we were 30 minutes off. Did you enjoy chapter 40? I did. Um, I really, really like being able to see more Fuhua because I love Fuhua. Um, the little Vita's awesome. The camera work. Great. Um, there's a little bit of issue, I would say, with, uh, the pacing seems fine. The pacing is fine. But the actual, um, terminology swip swapping so rapidly without any explanation, um, is a little confusing. Obviously, it, it, honestly, once you realize it, it's not confusing, like, at all. But for those that don't realize it or have a harder time realizing it, I, I think that can get really, really confusing. In terms of like the the different names for the different areas the fact that there's three different names for each spot is a little odd but uh, i'm sure they'll explain it and then in the upcoming chapters or something I'll, I'll understand um but yes overall i i've enjoyed it so far i have i have and i'm sad that i didn't get the football <laughs> um oh my god look it's my wife Cinadina. oh my goodness Oh wait, this is a corner piece. Love that. Look at us puzzling. Look at us puzzling. <laughs> All right, chat. I gotta go get some sleep. I am tired, tired, but I appreciate you guys being here. Uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you tomorrow. Mwah. Have a great night.